And do you think all of the teams have figured out the strategies for these maps? No. Because Name was like, we were grinding some games yesterday just trying to get familiar before the games kick off. Yeah, I mean, you know, for Vista, it's been out for a bit. You know, I played it right when it dropped and, you know, it just got out, I think, like two weeks reps on it and the community surely because it just got added to ranked like 36 hours mm -hmm. ago so we're all gonna be learning this together it's gonna be a lot of fun i'm gonna tell you what though spoiler alert we're already going to see one if not both of these new maps in our next series okay. atlanta phase is not afraid to play any map anywhere any game mode and here's a look at their opponent on the day we open it up with a fight against the brand new minnesota rocker as they welcome gunless and standy up to minnesota and then it's vegas legion with the new map Maps taken on LA Gorillas. This is day one, week one of your major three qualifiers, and it starts after this. Slice up your competition with the Executive Chef Operator. Now available in-game in the Call of Duty store. The Call of Duty League is brought to you by Monster Energy, the official energy drink of the CDL. I wasn't muted, I was on a different, I was on a different source for my mic. I was on a different source for my damn mic. We good, Tony? Delivered. A fat delay? What would I have? No, no delay on. You got a two time every time on YouTube. There's no, there's no delay on this website, but YouTube is, uh, the playback, the playback speed is always a few steps behind. You got a two time every time. Anytime you watch a YouTube stream, you have to make sure you get you two time every single time. Because if not, then you're behind the, uh, like I don't know why the, the it isn't auto catch up badly. It's very very annoying. Brett was good. Queens was good. Secrets. It's a J, my blooders. Is that almost time? It's almost time for his match back in for major three qualifiers, man. I have to play a one match weekend. I'm pretty sure. I think they only play on Sunday tomorrow or on Sunday against Face. But Face is a two a two match weekend, so we just kind of. I feel like it's always better to have a two match weekend, but like it sucks because like it just goes back and forth. Just horrible chat. They need, to, they need to figure this out, man. I have a plan. Uh, yes, yeah, secret. If you did the camo glitch, you, you probably got checked by Activision, right? Oh Hopefully, you haven't got it. Uh, I think you should say. I think you shouldn't say that. I think you should say maybe I haven't gotten checked. Maybe, you know what I'm saying? To be fair though, Chad, you are, I'm not lie, Chad, you are brain dead. Genuinely, you are brain dead if you use that on your CDL account. I probably, like if anyone, if Tyler told me, yo, I'm using it on my CDL account, I literally told him you're brain dead. I would tell him this face, you are brain dead. You have CT. Gameplay intros, like, lag out. It is time. It is time. It is time. Stage three qualifiers, and this one features a fan favorite. Atlanta Phase taking home the major two title. Now they put their online pride on the line. Oh, uh, yeah, Goon. They, they get new accounts, Goon, because the servers they plan are different than ours. You say struggling Minnesota squad, but they've overhauled half the roster, right? So now we're putting in. Yo! They did so Pierce dirty with that picture, bro. The majority can go out the window. You know, we won't talk about how they're three and eight. Nah, they did dirty. They did Pierce dirty with that picture. They gotta fix that. Seven in the last. They did him dirty, bro. I promise you, Pierce don't like that, bro. I trust. The major two champions in Atlanta phase, and although they're not too comfortable in this matchup when it comes to Monster Energy pregame, he doesn't look like that. I promise you, it had to be the angle they're using or something. I promise you. We did get rid of a couple of maps that would help. 
Yeah, I mean, it's a brand new team, right? So yeah. I'm not really going to look at that old map pool. You know, there are some clear things that they're going to be focused on improving here throughout this stage, especially their search and destroy. And you can see new team, better hard point. 3 and 10, last 13 hard points, as not Ali just what? mentioned. See, you're bringing in Standy and they did them dirty, bro. who have been great my boy. players throughout their career. So pairing them alongside Accuracy, who's extremely disciplined, and Linz, who looks like he can be a Rookie of the Year candidate. It's a high-power team, right, that can slay in, in hard points. So I'm excited to see. What is success for Minnesota today? Uh, they got, I mean, I take I mean, Mexico still as well. Go to a game five. Play play close. Close. All right, Minnesota. Good luck because you're taking I chop map one for the first match to qualify for major three is Vista HP. It's about to be a fucking banger. Vista map one, and we got six star map five if we go there. Potentially, I don't know if you ever lost peak form, to be honest. One of the most consistent players in the game, but if we're going to talk about players, Selium loves this matchup. 1.42 in this head to head. And on the flip side, they all have a point seven versus Atlanta phase. So for them, this is just another day in the office. Yeah, I'm just excited to see them on the new maps. You know, we're going to have the new maps throughout this series. They're always working on their map pool out the gates. Uh, you guys talked about Simp. The guy was dominant at the last tournament. You know, this is a team that they did through respawn. 9 and 2 in control, 13 to 5 in hard point, right? And their search and destroy was their worst game mode. That's so terrifying for the rest of the competition. For the Monster Energy pregame, 12 and 7 in active hard point maps, 1 and 5 on the map. is map 2, Rio, I think, secret. Rio, map 2, Karachi, map 3, Rio, like map 4. This map set is horrible for Minnesota. I'm so confused at the way they're playing maps that they have to be super aggressive on with Standy being a rattier player than Vivid and Linz being a Standy type of player with Vivid. Look at this map set. This is a banger map set. Like, bang out. Like, run at them. Nothing has changed, by the way, for FaZe. FaZe Vito subbase immediately. First match of the qualifier already getting rid of the only map. In my opinion, the first First map that got a shit got taken out. Just appreciate like we don't have the triple the state and invasion in the middle now. We just have a nice spread, different maps. Uh, but honestly, if I'm sipping a BZ, I'm looking at map sets right now. Like, yo, I'm about to have a good time. Chad, it's time to make it official. Get your predictions in right now, as it's time for your scuff pickums. And let's see who's in the lead after that event. Somehow, Nameless is approaching 80 points. Nameless. Oh. I'm gonna make you go third. I'm going first. Atlanta phase is gonna be my pick today. Ooh, I, do I go crazy and try go to crazy. and try to go crazy? Go standy on me. I'll go crazy, Minnesota Rock. She's going not? Minnesota. I can catch up. Wow, I'm gonna go with Atlanta phase. Atlanta <laughs> phase. <laughs> Alley Cat <laughs> takes <laughs> Minnesota. Try this. Alley Cat spinning or is she spinning some bullshit? Going down here in our first matchup. It's time to send it over to the casters. We have the original Joey D with Maven. Uh, thank you, thank you. Yeah, every time I hear Joey D when they're talking about Joey Receives, it pisses me off a little bit. I'll be honest with you. That's fine. It's, it's all good. Just, just I, you know, bit. we talked about it. I think it was last year, champs. I was like, it's all good, man. You can have it. Yeah. You can <laughs> so have you guys it. hash that out? We didn't really hash it. I was like, it's, it's all good. It's, it's all good. It's too nice. You're too nice. Cap was pissed actually. Yeah. He's like, bro, we can't allow that to happen. But I was it's like, good. whatever. Uh, yeah. Well, we get ready for this one. Um, listen, on one side, Minnesota. They, they've talked about a new team. We have a lot going on there, but. Uh, it reminds ah, me a bit. Gunner's got the cam of, off. Uh, what, Miami kind of last... It's who had the haircut buff, chat. Haircut buff always the matters. He look good, feel good, play good. MC he is looking like he is homeless. Is like a good or a bad MC thing? looks like he got top 12 at the events. In MC, way, get you a barber, baby. Points, which is the bad part. Yeah. It can be good, though, this show. Maybe potentially... Fizzle's out, chat. Fizzle's out from both sides. Boom. Boom. Standy chugging a Red Bull while we're sponsored by Monster. I said we. Let the young CDO. Lock in, lock in, lock in. Let's go. Yeah, again, you're trying to find some CDO. And it was also Lock in, lock in, lock in. It's game time, game time. Same time. And now we've got new stuff coming in now with our new maps. But for Atlanta Fakes, you know, it feels a little weird. I did just say that secret bar for bar. Very impressive result. Like weeks go by. It feels like it's so long ago they got the win, but it was still. Seeming like, I know, it doesn't feel like ages, though. I've been busy, but yeah, no, it definitely does. I went to Colorado, saw my dog. Like, I've just all sorts of stuff going on, but it feels like it's been ages, but like, looks like. I wonder what the lines were for this map. No, 100%. I think everybody goes over on this map, no bullshit. I'm going to lock into everybody over 21 kills. Everybody over 21.5. Or 20.5. You're coming to a lazy. I can chill out here a little bit with the lay already. The stage, maybe it caught off guard, but I think we're starting on Vista Hardpoint. You're going to go 100% because you have to, and they always do, really work on that map pool. 
Yeah, so one of those things that maybe just helps you not get a little Yeah, stay sleep, motivated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is a team where I don't know that that's needed to be a thing, considering they're the most consistent team in the history of our eSport when you talk about the past, like, five years. But it doesn't hurt, surely, to have something to work towards, something to improve on. Jesus Christ, I'm awesome. Uh, yeah, you got to get that trade. previous map said they were looking pretty damn strong. But we'll see what Rocker can get going early. It's, uh, yeah, this new duo, kind of a Lindsay and Standy. I would assume that Team that. White, a.k.a. Know, Team Minnesota, is, is on good side to start them out. Watch. I know it's been a while since we've seen him in that form. But with this guy's in his bag, he's disgusting. No, and obviously, you know, he's talked about teamwork being very important. And uh, that teamwork, he's trying to bring it to this Minnesota Rocker team. And I think Actress and Gunless, I don't think there's going to be a worry there. They're going to figure out a way they want to play Call of Duty and, and try to get the entire team on the same page. I'm kind of interested to see how this Lynn Standy duo does play out because sure. you had Vivid here. Vivid, very fast player. I think probably set up Lynn's at times. Standy, I think he kind of be the opposite. Slower, sort of finds his kills, but it may put Lynn's in a bit of a tougher scenario. Well, and it's becoming more of a conversation, especially with this title, because early on, you know, sort of your sub. This backs up already, Tyler. Eight and three, handing out some much. crazy ones. Now we're like some the insane ones. Were very much starting to become a thing. Like your sub duos are taking over. You saw the simple of easy that you were used to seeing at that last event, but uh, so far so good. Now we talk about the crazy team sound. Joe, let's uh, talk about this map a little bit. Well, I was gonna say accuracy just got blessed with a spawn right there. Is uh, I mean Vista. I think what we're really gonna focus on is P3 and P4. They are for whatever reason right next to each other uh, <laughs> in that rotation. But I think this is where you can Should've really find a giant lead here because I think Should've Vista a spot just because the doors are start from what I've seen right still very early. There is it's sort of free old fire off how spacing. If you get put in the bad spawns. It's going to take some time to work across the map. Yeah, well, I mean, usually we want our hard points to kind of crisscross, right? Like, what do you think about it? Like, we go north and south and east to west as we try to get across the map. But, yeah, now this one you're going to kind of stay left side. Oh! oh trying to rack up some time. Selium trying to explore the outskirts of the map, and he's going to get punished. Like Gunless comes through with two as well, so three will drop. It's Linz then also. It's on streak. Jarrell did call the Linz Masterclass. Jarrell said Linz is going to give out back shots. Now a lead change here for Rocker, so... As you talk about three and four, oh, a moment now for Rocker job. to pounce. And this is what I mean. If you are phased now working with you, you have to go together. You cannot get staggered. You have to play your life. Old traditional hard point at, at a, a big moment of some of these hills. So draws they against do a number seven. Draw, draw, draw draws win the final one on one. But as you said, we're staying on this left side fight. for P4. And what's interesting about P4 is this hill wraps all the way around that wall where accuracy is right now. So you can at least contest this if FaZe does good get teamwork from Minnesota. Really good teamwork. Well, they hold the push. A good little flurry there from FaZe. Kind of get into the last hard point. Find a can way I make the game louder? Tell me no talk to me. On this early point, but that doesn't come. The next wave, it's all Rocker. They He's lock it down. The left they again. get set up. And now the moments you're talking about, FaZe have got to be disciplined. Cannot be staggered. Have got to look for the push. This has been oh, all the way what up. What the Rocker. fuck? Is standing out, winning an awkward one there on the steps, and he's on four in he's a row. Pinch, he's really dive, pinch. maybe towards some streaks of his own. He just tells teammates yeah, to live, then he just lives, run away. pressure for Atlanta Faze, but it's 35 seconds in. That's going to be three dead. Can he find oh, number six? no, no streaks. Six. MC just wanted to He's able to find two, almost a third, but you have a great lead here, and they cash in on those hills we talked about. P3, P4, they have the lead. Yeah, maybe the only saving grace if you're Atlanta is what? It was five in a row for Standy. It was five in a row for Linz. Neither is able to pick up that cruise. So I guess if you get beat it, beat up and battered a little bit at three and four, at least you don't give up. But on number two, he's number six. Chad, number two, he's number six. Huge gunfight. A BC versus accuracy. Wait, Tyler just got finished. Tyler, what? Oh, he's looking. I think okay, Tyler. Oh, really to when he got through, gang. Ah, we play your top bridge. We're missing Lamar. You got a kill. They should know he's there. Yes, number four was looking for it. Standing on this catwalk, trying to find a kill and trying to get to accuracy because he's still alive and they've had to focus on him. Huge from Lamar, which has allowed Rocker to get on the hill. Well, listen, we were wondering if we were to get to five and get to C. Maybe a six star search and destroy didn't seem likely, but hey, so far, Lynn just playing more aggressive this this map Remember, this than he played with Vivid. I, I will say that so far, like in this first half, the the person I'll probably credit with him playing way, way more aggressive than he did with Vivid. Let's ride it. Remember, they were beating all the top squads, they were beating your ultra, they were beating your optic. I think face was like the team that showed him down, but. Who knows? Maybe we'll see it again here. Yeah, maybe. Just as I say, <laughs> Face is undefeated on Rio Hardpoint. That is one of their go-tos. But uh, yeah, through the first set of hills, 30-point lead. I think Face do a, a great job bouncing back here. Simp trying to flip these spawns, get behind enemy lines. Is able to do that. Gunless trying to lock down top mid, but Simp is there. 
now just both teams fighting Oof. for control. Yeah, I'm more meant learning this one quickly. That, that looks insane from MC's POV. I feel like he should have won that. That might be a different conversation, but we uh, know about that headie. Sleepy knows. We'll Sleepy knows a little to too much about that headie. Who was uh, you know your MVP? From that tournament, from that final, it was an absolute final form. He's Secret, right it's, now, it's a lot easier. It's a lot easier said than done. Secret. Rockers, five in a row for if you've been playing Cod a certain way for a long time, and someone tells down, you to play this way, it isn't streak, able to be. For example, Hugh and Afro have always had the same problem for their entire careers. Forever. can you kill lobby for me no, or no? I can't, I can't. Sim's still lobby. Tower dead up middle, tower dead up middle. Top sign, 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 you want dead, you want dead on you. Time, 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 time. Sign, 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 sign. 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 Sign, 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 there's two, two lobbies to P1 right now. For Shun. Yeah, blue, blue. Yeah, happy, happy. No burger, I this one. no burger, dead. No, 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 They're gonna be lobby, guys. I'm trying to push one. Time, time, this one. Oh, keep blacked out. Lobby, let's go lobby, I'm pretty sure, guys. I'm picking up middle, I'm picking up middle. Yeah, one. I have a middle. Where's number four right there? Oh, he's on time already. He's left wall, left wall, left wall time in one bridge. He's left wall time. Left wall, left wall. Left wall, left wall, left wall. I'll pick up low, pick up low, one low, one low. I have low, I have low, I have low. Low, 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 low. Two low, two low, two low, two low. One blue stairs, one blue stairs, one blue stairs. I have one, I have one. One top blue stairs, I have one. I'm running against the fight. A lot of time for phase during that. Yo, Zach is much lower, brother. I appreciate it. No, Zach, I never got to you back, bro. Sorry, I apologize for Zach. He's always had solid comms, but I just want to say kind of remind you of fellow a little bit. We have a good stream, my brother. Here. No, no right, bullshit. I appreciate this, Agnes. Uh, you know, what are we watching? Talk? Yeah, great small talk out of Gunless. Uh, the Slay is there for Minnesota Rocker, but FaZe, they do an excellent job at P2. They get 40 to 50 seconds. Andy is playing pretty good, bro. Lead. And now, maybe for this yeah, keep in mind, the Simp is having a really tough game, and this, this is like a, a tied here, game. Like, already set up he was people. having I a really tough game. Last thing from his comms I like. was having. Realize, just, uh, kind of affirmation like confirmation on something like when they were saying like you know we're gonna push left or we're gonna hit this like him just sort of repeating it back so that yes i heard you type thing i don't know kind of like that but good stuff from godless but now uh, the streak that we saw earned earlier from standy starting to toss into the fray not going to be able to connect you're able to finesse and stay up if you are fantastic the side here number phase. eight they come through with three on the feed in that sequence as well. We hop over to Sims POV, who was once, what, 7 and 14, 7 and 15. Ooh. He's really started to fire back because he's gotten to about even. And probably it's a big a part of why this game has started swinging their favors. Now I'd be so excited yeah, if I that like Draza that. Draza at P2 really got going. Draza, we heard it and listened, like top sign over and over again. Yeah, he locked yeah, down this yeah. position, and now Sim getting going, looking for Jesus. He hits it, and on, on rotation, you have Draza trying to find it. But it is a foot race across the other side of the map. But I think Tyler starts it. Chris finishes it, bro. So it looks like right now. A huge gun fight. Now can he get some help? Not hey, yo, that boy is shooting. Uh, I think my reaction to the ooh is the, the fuck thing did you saw from Chris Simple in the camp. Because he's thinking he's got a streak. He loses one. That's a great gunfight win there from Lens. Now you got set up in the hard point. You made sure no streak come in. And now we get down to the nitty gritty, the final moments of this one. Once again, it's Lens with the Even if the game is tighter, Face has been amazing at P1, P2. So this is tracking. not a horrible situation for either team. traded out. Flurry of kills. Who's still standing tall, though? It's Gunless. Just use the bridge as best he can until the reinforcements come. Yeah, that's why you have to control P1 on this hill, right? Just those angles. Because really if you can force them first. to push down low, you have the top bridge, you have P1 control, it is just going to be free kills all day. But FaZe do a great job breaking on through that. P1, getting that angle on the gunless on the hill. Now 20 points away from winning Vista. And listen, I know it's you're playing against a new team, it's a new map, but the difference for FaZe this year has come in the hard point. These last few years is where the struggles have been. 
in the clutch moments at times, the wins have not been there. They've been going hard. They've been doing it late in games as well. Another the reason they're so good is because Tyler, out, Tyler and Chris are really good at pushing on these guys on P1. But these are the improvements these guys and have right, wanted for years right fight. now. They're working. Yeah. yeah, they are. Now 10 points away as they win this rotation. And well, it is the Tiny Terrace, 25 and 22, and then a BZ. He's got 50 plus engagements. He really got going. One of the Jesus. biggest improvements Jesus. from stage one to stage two was a BZ, and he starts off. Hey, Chad, I said everyone over 21, listen, and MC was the only one that didn't get there, bro. I was close enough. Low key was giving my motherfucking yeah, blood up. 14 or so, he ends up like positive three. <laughs> He sort of erupts over the mid part of that game and a big part of why they start to rally, as you said, kind of that P2, but they go up one. Sunday secret, Sunday okay, secret, not so tomorrow. You, tomorrow's you, fights. Well, you played, I think, when you were streaming, you played with some of your viewers on, you maybe hopped into How much time should I start with well. you guys? Thanks, chat. You've watched some scrims, I know, too, as you, you talked to his crowd and some of the phase guys, but now seeing it in official competition, what were your thoughts? No, I think good. I think it has a, a good pacing. Uh, I, again, I think you're really going to have to take your time to, to break those P3s. Oh, P4s shit. Yo. You get staggered. Chat, Mav said for the next series smoked, real quick to interrupt this but, first yeah, match of the day. Like, Mav said six star HP Karachi S&D Mav 3 high rise control. Beast to HP, last map, Brio. Another banger. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ooh, we have some good ass fucking maps to watch today. Six star HP next year is guaranteed, no matter what. And if we go to map four, we guarantee another Vista. So that's going to be a banger, bro. You see, this already makes the matches more enjoyable to watch, bro. Less, inv less invasion and control, less sub base hard point. Like, sub base hard point, in my opinion, it is the worst. Map mode combo in regards of entertainment to watch. Very, very, extremely boring map. Extremely, extremely boring map in game mode combo. A bunch of stuff there for no, you, it, Joe, it, 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 it hits home. <laughs> when I can just watch a map and it makes sense to my brain. Yeah. Uh, good, Travis. I want to Travis. Was good, my so, Yeah, I, I think so far there wasn't. Again, a couple of spawns are going to happen. Our teams are going to learn. Was my one close? How to not allow those to happen? Yeah. How just to depends how you think. Spawns, I, I, I think it was close. So far, so good. It's kind of the big. They were down by like 80 points, though, Travis. So about. that's kind of tough. That's a tough map to lose. The way at least on the second set of hills, able to break that P4. The cruise doesn't work for Minnesota. I, see, I guess it wasn't 80. It was what, 54 to 103. Like 60. But then the red. All right, Chad. I'm gonna piss him. I'm gonna come right back. I'm gonna come right back, and then we're gonna watch this map too. I mean, unless it's early, but. It's all mapping a rocker too in the sense that you got a new squad. Like to hear some of the comms from them. Unfortunately, things were kind of unraveling as we went to listen in, but you were in the lead till the midway point of that game until phase really started to get it going. Now you try to bring it back on search and destroy. And for Rocker, yeah, I mean for a while there was just like the game five was their weakness. Like they just got to so many game fives. They have we weren't really sure like what if a chamber's going to come because they I'm were surprised by it. Yeah, because they were so competitive, but it just gets to a point where it's like it's really cool you're competitive, but like we need CDL <laughs> points. Like it's you gotta great, win. great job. Like you guys. Well, yes, I'm surprised. Maybe it's a two-man move instead of one. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I think stage one, major one, you get top four, and you could see throughout stage two. Yeah, they were competitive, thinking the best team should have won some of those matches, and you're just like, all right, this maybe this break will help them, but then a two-man change comes in. I was a bit surprised by it. I thought maybe one, but here we are. Well, I think it's surprising because like. If it was just the competitive thing, sure, but you also got the top four with that. Right. Like, so you got That's the top it. four, and then you have this lapse where, like, you know, uh, you think about that stage two qualifier and, like, could have easily been, like, three or four more wins, which would have changed where you started the tournament, and who knows what would have been the outcome. So, yeah, I'm kind of surprised, but no, I think you kind of nail it. More surprised it was, like, maybe a two-man change. But I mean, fact is, we're midway through the year. Maybe, uh, you know, a blessing for our bottom eight teams is it's so top four heavy where nobody's really out of it, and they have a chance to go out and get standing gunless, this is just, it's firepower, right? Like, you have a chance now to pretty much stack up against everyone in the league. Yeah, and we're gonna see, like, if this added firepower is really gonna be what's gonna solve maybe some of those issues, because a lot of times, like, when you're, you know, when you're losing those game five, it's, like, really tight series. At least in my head, it's not usually like a firepower thing. It's, uh, what little small mistake do we make here? What small mistake do we, like, if you think of the things that Plague Boss did, Plague Rocker, that's how I usually look at it. Like, little mistakes here and there, but, more often than not, when uh, you're on the cusp but not quite hitting, and you try to add some firepower, and speaking of firepower, you see. There's no way, that, Travis. There is no way that's a picture of Pierce. And if they did, they did him dirty, bro. They did him dirty as fuck. My man's big. Lock in, chat. Map two, map two. Lock in, lock in, lock in, lock in. Right into it now. 
Rio search map number two. Yeah, this is where they won major major number two, right? Uh, the last map versus Optic in that best of seven. They would slow it down, but also it was kind of just this tiny terror show, top middle between Abizi and Simp, just finding these first bloods. Time and time Jesus. again, is they take mid map control. No away, flag jacket in search. Bit of retake towards top B, to give with it a up, sub too. Instead, Lin gets stupid. caught. Yeah, he gets isolated, and yeah, you see the nades. Gonna we be smoke able to we... hit the one Simtex maybe connecting. Frag come on through, then draws the lines of another. So he's gonna be working on the ace in this round. Well, until Sim gets the kill, I'll be two for Sim, two for draws. Pick them apart one by one, and nice opener there from Atlanta Face. That's pretty. Yeah, well, with the final two, that was like the map where was it Celium had like Kenny like seven rounds in a row. Oh, bro. <laughs> just some awful timings for Ken time and time again. Well, it wasn't even like a timing thing. A lot of them were just like one-on-one -on -one gunfights. It was a headshot for Cell. Because I remember yeah. I saw Cell after it. I'm like, Cell, did you headshot Kenny like six times that map? He was like, yeah, I was frying him. <laughs> I guess so. Yeah, he just, no, it was like one of those ones where, yeah, come I think it was just, boy Andrew. Where it was just a head and head shot was the difference. Nice. It looked real frustrating though yeah. for Kenny. Yeah, team changes, map changes, also weapon This is fire. We get right? the MC first day of matches, we get six star and we get Vista things. map one. That is fire. All right, the no more four bullets. So we'll see how much of it. I'm excited to watch how six star plays in a pro match. But still going to be the same guns in the equation for now. But yeah, Draza and Sip with the early kills. Draza with another. He's had back to back first bloods, once with the nade, now with the gunny leading the way. And. Rocker falling steadily here. Yeah, it's kind of you, you're, you're just giving them individual fights time and time again. And this could be, I don't know, the play you've been in my chat every day. A new uh, roster, just trying to get on the same sure. page. But you're trying to slow the map down throughout both of these. You're spreading the map and then you're just getting picked apart. There's no trade opportunities. It's Jesus, one -on -one brother. After one on one in phase, they win every single one of them. I gotta see you the other people because that looks insane you are from his. Well, you know, you're trying to think about how to slow down it good search team and yeah like slow it down uh, okay sure. that wasn't that bad but i Oof, think when you watch somebody like, like that he just got absolutely team, they're very good search and destroy players usually very good search and destroy players are very good at what like same back shots. getting information and getting information with confidence in the sense of like clearing things quickly it's like i don't know if you try to play slow against them I, it sometimes turns into phase just getting a lot of map control <laughs> and yes. then isolating people is what ends up happening yeah just kind of choking them out especially this guy i mean when he is confident in search nobody's going to stop this phase team it just feels like draws a He's really stepped that up to stage one. I did hear about the same thing too. In a major two victory. Yeah, no, he did. And he's doing uh, the same thing. Let's see, let's I see think what we were wondering, you know, when we first talked to Crowder after the change, like, listen, we think he's a great player, but I just thought they needed his swagger a little bit. Like, he was going to track, uh, talk trash. He'll take whatever heat on social. <laughs> I mean, there's plenty of that going around after the major. And Insane. I think they just needed some of that. And uh, it showed, obviously, with the win, but uh, now. They get another first blood, another bomb getting planted. These rounds have been efficient. All right, Dylan, let's get some on the board. This is starting to remind me of Warhawk S and D versus SB. Like we were getting to that territory a couple more rounds, Joe. Couple more, yeah. <laughs> but Gunless gets him on the board. Now you have a one versus three for Standy. Turns into one on two, 30 seconds. Some time to work with. Yeah, I did see them quiz look about us. Nice little smoke, but that's just gonna give them the info. They're like, hey, you can run through it. He's gonna hop the bomb. They're gonna double check it. Standy trying Ooh. to find the one on three with the smoke, but does as not. As sad as it is to say, that was the yeah, closest a round has been got to be in Minnesota's real round. So it's kind of solid. And right that was a 1v3. A little, it wasn't little even close. Snap back from Cell to kind of finish this off. Honestly, I thought his character model looked a whole lot different than that actually ended up playing yeah, right? out. Was just, oh, probably it's because I mantled the vehicle. Like, <laughs> I thought he, like, for some reason was dancing around a little bit to get that, but uh, no, looked uh, as pedestrian as could be in the kill cam. But it's been all first blood. So that's just really. That was a really good play for me. Like, yeah, that was a 10 out of 10 play. So far. Yeah, Rocker, they've tried to spread the map. Tried to do it last time. This time, looks like they're going to go right over towards A. They have Cell and Simp here. There's the info trophy over them. Simp now just going to wait. Hope to hit a nade. Here comes the utility. Ooh. Get some info behind the nade. Able to hit. No follow up. Selium looking for his fifth in a row as he's backing up from nades. Now the pressure is going to come out. He's got a rival though, so he's ready to dance. Oh, Unfortunately, as he goes around the circle, Abizi is going to get caught. It's a, kind of an awkward sequence there at the van. Sell now trying to get crazy out. Him and Draza are trying to clutch up. It got scary because Abizi, it took so long for them Draza's to push up. Abizi repositions, but yeah, just sort of that timing for Simp. 
Then Ibiza gets caught off guard, that first gunfight, the first blood goes to Rockner, and now you're in a position to win the round. Well, I mean, Sim's playing back then. You're not thinking about the shots coming in back then. That happens really fast, I'm sure. I bet mean, Ibiza snaps, but it's a little too late. As the aggression from Standy likely ends up paying off, Rocker get a nice round, but yeah, that just looked like, uh, yeah, kind of like awkward little situation there. <laughs> yeah, because with the BZ at boxes, you have this crossfire with with Selium up top, where as soon as they cross his Hummer, you're just going to start getting team shot by all of Atlanta phase. And then if, if Simp here is there a couple of weeks, he just hops on up or just holds the white van so they can't push up towards the BZ. Like the crossfires were there. But whatever timing that rocker player got. Sandy, you know, yeah. Sandy just hit it. Yeah, yeah it, just, it, it led to, to the round win. Yep, yep. Ends up being a fantastic play of aggression there. We'll see if that one low start for Lynn's really slow start. You need, you need the all-star to tee up for their team. So we get back to offense now for a phase. Trophy up top, going to protect everybody for now for the rocker side. They're maybe a little worried about some early aggression up that kind of outward B street, but playing deep, it's going to be accuracy. And now you've got Deddy out from a BZ. Yep, that's what I was thinking because he's not bond anymore. It was either BO4 or World War II. Yeah, you don't have anyone up top middle. If it's LG now, that's BO4. He's gonna rotate on over. He's gonna be the first man up. And well, he's making that play players. every single round. He's made on, on defense info with the slide, maybe catch a chalk timing, it, but it works against him. He's now gunless, just trying to play his life. He does just that, finds a kill, gets out. Yeah, that's just. I mean, he's trying to help accuracy there, but the face know that, <laughs> so they're kind of ready and waiting. He gets caught, but. Now, what do you do here? The three versus three is a BZ. The movement a little awkward for a moment. Gets out. Lamar, the Lamar lags. Gets out, but Cell at least gets the trade on the Lamar. You do got to check, though. Over to draw the POV. He's having a hell of a bro, match. NY, yo, Minnesota Jerry looked Jansen absolutely standing, lost, bro. Trying to get out. Not quite able to do it. Just never a chance to kind of get back this to This is a really tough assessment on how to, how to rank Minnesota, though, Lake. His face take the round. They're playing face. Yeah, it's just boy, a question of it doesn't Goofy, let's go, slide, baby. Like maybe he just watches that cross, gets prone there, but... Doesn't have the info we do. Again, that first blood being costly right now for Rocker. Yeah, I'm sure you know what what accuracy saw too. He's thinking they're flying at him, but yeah, he just hold the bridge for a second maybe. But if you do that, they can just literally run under the bridge. I guess I'm mean, relying on accuracy to hit his shots or make a play. But Linz is. Uh, it doesn't really matter what decisions he's making right now. <laughs> it seems he's struggling in this map too. He's 0-4. See if he can get anything going in this one. Kind of a similar spot now for Draza on that side as they look at number three and number two. They get pressure forward. He the backs up. The rest of the team kind of working to hit it's it on the read. flank. And yes, it is. I, I don't know if they had info on this cross or what, but it's three on the flank for. I'm not running. They I'm all to hybrid, bro. No bullshit. But now Rocker. Every sub should be running hybrid as a team. Now down a man. Is selling able able to win another one. Because of Bezu, well, he got credit for that kill. Why? Right? It was Simp that actually ended up killing him. So, Ooh, despite Lins the making a really good play. he's still gun up with that rifle. Oh, he Selly and melting people as they're trying to hit the edge. Accuracy can't get across. All on Lens now, who got his first kill, looking for more. Not going okay. to happen. Damn, Tom I thought he was going to flank me too. That was, was going to be such a good play. I thought that was going to play back. out so well for Rocker. I, I don't know. They saw. I don't think they saw anyone, but they just all backed up. Maybe just VOD. You know, prep work coming into this match, but as soon as they saw the top E, they knew two to three players would be pushing on through. Looks like they were repositioning for it. Still, face coming on top. Yeah, I think if it's like if they got there a second earlier before your like you know rival nuke range, well, okay, I can nuke anywhere, but you know what I mean. Like the fact that BZ was just able to kind of win that first fight, I catch them at a little more range though. Yeah, I might just zap them, but. It looked nutty, though, from, like, <laughs> that POV. Gunless just comes out, like, pre-fire jumping around the corner. Like, oh, they got this. No, no, they do not. So one more round needed now for FaZe. My and brother Herm was getting my this. dog. They're working right to be Lone Man for now will be Lens, who still looking to really make a, his presence known within this map. Yeah, and FaZe, no, I, I mean, they've done this a couple of offensive rounds now where they've just taken B for free. So bomb planted 40 seconds. If maybe you're going to play for these mid, retakes, this is where you have to cash in if you are a rocker. Giving up this spot now, trying to use the smoke from Standy. Almost catches a BZ. The smoke got fucked up because Tyler pushed that. And that was actually but really after good all of that, after the smoke are down, it's still a four versus four. Tom Goodwill now, 25 seconds to go. BZ reposition, snap back, Shh. takes a second, and once again, just able to weasel away. 
The Cells POV, pistol up, pistol a pop, and last man up. It is accuracy. Look over the 1v3 ice. Not going to happen. They send it at him. Just crazy it back shots right now. It crazy is ass back it is shots. Dominance there from Atlanta Phase Damn. in the map, too. Six to one. It's all smiles. And yeah, I, I think you kind of nailed it. Like, listen, I, I think it's a lot of things. Wonder so what's like next, man. I wonder what's away. next. Draza coming in for this team has been huge, right? Selim has just been sell. I think he's just been a constant for them these last few years, even talking about the position stuff. But like, even with Simp being like in the MVP form, the biggest thing is like, Abizi is back being Abizi, bro. Like, I had no problem with like Simp winning MVP because he was God. But like, Abizi has been, once God. again, just a tear on the map. No, yeah, just playing confident. Tough game from Liz, a lot of those first from He got blooded five times, I think, or four times. Like, that was and really that's tough. just what FaZe do. Uh, you know, Rocker opted to give up a lot of I don't of know why. Why time did they play them? I, I wish I could see the videos, but they played them on their best maps. This is the this is map they've only lost once, and then real hard point they're undefeated, and then Vista. Take a lot of time, a lot of repetitions. Obviously, a new map, six star. The page. Phase know that they're playing they them on their worst one. control, though. Yeah, like, statistically, just one of the better teams that you know playing aggressive. Statistically, and not this is the worst control. They, just, they, 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 they don't have a map control, but that's their worst control. They can play for info. They they can play for map control, not throw away lives. They, they've always been solid at doing that, and uh, yeah, they got to be on the other side. So far, um. These kind of came out, I guess, as you expect. This one, their last tournament, so not not much we're looking at there. But what about Rocker? And I, what could he even take from that search? I, I thought the, you know, I mean, search is going to take time. I thought the hard point was was competitive. I mean, you know, new map, new roster. They look they look solid on it. Okay, all right. Well, that will do it uh, for okay. our map two. We're ready to continue on this best of, best of five. We'll see if Faze can close down the map three, or maybe somehow we go the distance. We get to see a six star. Uh, but for now, we go to break. When we return, it is control. Nameless waving back at you. Never miss a match of your favorite teams with the Call of Duty League calendar sync. Uh, Here's the fun just to get chokes land on Rio again, yet the, the, they definitely aren't going to win Rio. Card you can Wait, who's going to run a sub? Pierce? Upgrade your game it's going to be weird. Pierce on a sub. Save $30 on the official CDL collection. Not the scuff, by the way, too, man. They're selling me a new controller. Thank God, bro, because my shit is my shit is broken. The Call of Duty League is brought to you by Monster Energy. Chow, how many controllers do you guys think you guys should go through within a uh, one uh, 12 month period? How much do you guys think? Uh, that are like, you know, scuffs or beavers or or whatever. Nah, Lamar's not going to be a sub. There's no way Lamar's not. There's a 0% chance Lamar's on a sub. Lamar being on a sub was when Clay was on a sub. I remember Clay was on a sub uh, in World War II for a little bit, and Alec was running the menu, and it was crazy. I'm thinking two is Poyito as well. I'm thinking two. I was used to. I'm not gonna lie to you. This might have been. This might. This sounds super spoiled, but I was used to going through like four controllers a year. I'm not gonna lie. Like a new one every three months max. Invasion is. Uh, Faze's worst control map, Faze are 4 and 1 on Karachi, and I've lost 3 in times on Invasion, so it wouldn't be... So the, the, the problem, that, the reason I disagree, uh, Swagger, is because they like Invasion more than they like Karachi. Because of how good they are at, on offense. But obviously that's kind of like, that's like a not known factor, right? That's like a not known, fa that's like a not known factor. They, they're very, very confident on Invasion, though. Extremely confident on Invasion. Like super, super confident. They'd rather play than Karachi. Just because of the way sometimes Karachi, like the map gets spread sometimes, people are able to cut you off and force you to hop over the border or take that extremely long route on offense. You know what I'm saying? That's the only problem. That, that's the reason that Karachi is kind of tough. It's good. Dude, it's just the, the, the maps on uh, Infinity War games and Sledgehammer games. <clears throat> they're, they're not laid out to make the maps be super competitive for control. The game mode kind of sucks. I kinda, I mean, it does kind of, it, it, it sucks. Control is horrible on, on these fucking maps, these games too. I use the same controller from W2 to BO2. I, I mean, bro, it's a day. You gotta think they were free skis. They were for the free skis, twin. That's why it was four. It, it wasn't because uh, I was actually going on with a, dude, I haven't bought a controller since like mw that's the last time i bought a controller i think an mw like four years ago five years ago 
For some reason, they break, though. Like, look, like this controller, I've had it for... When did I get it? Let me tell you right now. I'll tell you when I got it right now. Let's check my dick. To be fair, though, I'm, I'm really careless with the controller that, that I use. Uh... I got it in August. I got it in August, and damn, I started using it in November though, and it kind of broke. Now, I mean, that's a long time. That's six months. That's a long time. Hello, and welcome back. Need less than 44 kills for. Five here is our first match of our qualifier three for the CDL 2024 season. Damn, you look good, Ivan. You look really, that is a really good parlay. Selium, who is uh, very good at just about everything statistically. Bro, Ivan, you yeah, look amazing. Lock in, Ivan. You just need a round five. They really do when you just look at this. Wombo, I am four days away just, just for just one month in a row, baby. Just to run a and I'm down. You can see it right there. He's number one across the board. And you're kind of seeing sort 15 of, uh, pounds? Some of the videos. 14 pounds? The side, the face side, like the mind games between those two and how this man just unfazed pounds by most? whatever they do. Uh, do what is that, that equal to? I think it, I think it, I assume it was a CW year. Seven, eight kilos? And not MW. But I remember like, you know, I don't know, I, six I kilos, seven or six kilos. Oh, uh, Wombo to translate to you. Every time base play that they were just like first. Being a lot stronger, like first feeling a lot better, bro. Like we got, I was like, we gotta have something else. Wombo? We show every map they play. Yeah. <laughs> they were like first in I think the 16th or the 15th is yeah, one month, like without missing a single day. No matter, no. Rest days, yes, but I'm still resting while going to the gym. You know, I stretch. I do a little bit of hit cardio on the Stairmaster. And some, like, lunges. And... Uh, get on the fucking uh, treadmill too, and then go outside for like a play basketball, run, walk, whatever. Nah, I'm not getting skinny as hell, but I'm just trying to. I just want to be better every day, everyone. I promise you. Like have good, like really good discipline. I could be a better leader, brother, friend, son, entertainer, everything. And I was like, I think that is a big part. You definitely know that though. Step into the pit. Looking for some help, may not need Lynch it. lagging? He's Did Lynch just lag out? What the fuck? Now looking to push out for the final one, but uh, he'll just clear the zone. It's, uh, the defense looking like the offense for a second there. They two inside, just locking down A. Yeah, clearing that point. And then a couple of big individual gunfights here. One uh, by Rocker, at least get out of this trap. The first one by Lynch, the second one by Standy, and then they go right back into a 3-4 uh, down should have tried getting scenario. involved a little faster It's right already now. 30 seconds off the clock here. Is Rocker gonna have to try to get out? The good thing for them is Junkyard is open. That's where Accuracy and Linz are gonna go. Gunless will find the first kill. Maybe that will open things up over towards the A point, but not yet. Gotta deal with Abizi and Red. So much room to finesse and dominate there inside. Oh, the no. For Abizi. I don't, I don't, I don't care. Oh my God, God Pierce. Roaring, gunless. Nearly sent oh. back the challengers with that gunfight. Draws us on one. I mean, that's just a little pop-up that hits. Yeah. I, I, you know, we've seen it time and time again. That pop-up hits. You lose him for a second. Did, you, can, can he and talk like that? Is in 15 he just seconds. said he got sent back the challengers. Ah, oh, hell no. Nah. That is and insane, the point twin. We nice nice talking crazy. Yeah, no, <laughs> it out. And I feel like anytime you think it's going to be like perfectly bottled up, usually something happens. As a last, last ditch effort, but we'll see if it'll end up being enough. They still have a lot of progress to do. I imagine you're going to send a push of this to your face. There's 11.5 seconds. Why the hell wouldn't you? They'll try to set this up, but gunless. It's funny, his only death was that gunfight. <laughs> he dropped outside of that. He was 4 and 1 to that point. They get onto it. The contest is here. They are fighting for it. Abizi, Draza, get the kills. Time dwindling once again. Number 8 should try to make a player faster. You got to go if you are Rocker. On oh Whoa. shit! Nice little snap there from Linz on it at point one. Like basically it's zero. You get on it, but you Linz, Linz has potential, bro. Linz has potential. Take shots from Tyler, but Linz, Linz, Linz has a lot of potential. Barrel there, just burning a BZ. And I think what I like throughout that round is you. Saw oh, yo, I appreciate you, Wambo. Thank you so like much, Wambo. Trust so me, I am Wambo. Nice there's so That's what I'm saying. I'm saying Wambo. I don't really care about like as you say the progress, right? It's more about just like. And it can be I, the best thing in the even world. Even if I don't see it here or here know, or wherever, here or yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I call it the I feel it right here, bro, yeah, every day. That's what it seems like. That's not really so corny. If you have your, your teammates around you, are like, I can win fuck. anything yeah, here. I feel it right here if every day. If you don't, it's just like, all right, little. where am I going to get shot from? Yeah, you're like, 
Natalie Portman in Black Swan, dude. You're twirling, just trying to find people. Sure, yeah, we can go with that. Yeah, I don't know. I thought I went to Ballerina Jell, <laughs> <Okay>. but uh, <laughs> I'm now to face his offensive attack. <laughs> Jammer, you're funny, Jammer. We'll see if they can close things out with efficiency. Oh! oh! Then snap it oh! Top standing. Tyler got it back in blood. Oh, he got it back in blood. Oh, easy, oh, okay. maybe uh, the juice is flowing after he got gunned by Lens. My goodness, yeah, I mean, just these rivals are hitting. It's that initial stat snap. Damn. I swear the rival, sometimes you just kind of lose it. I think that's what we're seeing from some of these gunfights. But if you hit your initial it, bullet, I swear that thing is just a laser. Yep. No, I, that is Call of Duty in a nutshell. Hey, your first first bullet. Welcome to Aim Assist Central. It's going to stick. It's Sim trying to stick yes, people sir. in the yes, dirt. Yes, sir. Wombo, trust me. This Seth, second bit of objective. Gotta be a better uh, get that minute extension. They're also gotta be a better version of me, bro. Trust. Junk and that'll side. reflect towards you guys, hopefully. You know what I'm saying? Like, that way. Already when I obviously towards you, too, you do land. it to so me, but like, you've given this up. You'll let the be a good influence for all the youngins. The biscuit or risk it for the biscuit. Maybe somebody that's You're older than yourself too. Shit, I don't want try to them for B. I'm pretty sure they might have to start risking it for some biscuits. Though. Yeah, are we oh. risking biscuits? There's biscuits everywhere, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> to get back into this map. Yeah, A. Gonna go over to Atlanta Aww. phase, but on the opposite side. I'm just gonna fight that more nice confident. Like he should have ran that on my head. To find Draza, and he will to at least set up this layer of defense. For Jack, Minnesota it's it's Rock. bad, Jack. You missed some. <laughs> Tyler just literally did someone yeah, kind of crazy now, honestly. for a two piece. But you gotta hold this off. You know they get the offensive round, but even though I know it can be favored on Karachi at times, and the hole just gets deeper with some desperation. You're trying to stop this if you are Rocker. Standing, trying to tuck away. Strong enough for the first, not quite for the second. Gunless now still inside of red. Boy, dumpster side alley. Wait, draws just eight and two and they're down lives? What way. the you're fuck? Kind of all over the map right now if you are phased, but Sally, I'm still finding kills. Yeah, I think they're just trying to get some map control and then sort of collapse onto the point. You're yeah. hoping Draws is able to work through the spawn. He's in a yoke port again, because Rocker have done such a good job inside of red, behind Linz, behind Standy, locking this down. And so what does that force you? When you're you spawning Coop's side, you kind of have to go through uh, the middle of the map or work the defensive spawn. Draza just around this yellow car just trying to I'd like to, to see Linz back up and get red control. Like, uh, Linz should be in red. With, yeah, with superior positioning. In red or male. Fight. And sometimes this is where we've seen like Atlanta face on this particular map, like on offense. Uh, like they've had their moments they've struck, but sometimes it's been so much time like kind of trying to get that perfect setup. I think he was throwing a nade or something maybe. And then it just seems like they've been kind of run around mid-map in red for five minutes until the round's over. Um, Standish gameplay itself, you guys. Three players here the way that he up. plays. Selium has turned this into a three-on-two. Nothing wrong with that, well. by the way. Hydra plays selfish, too. That gets picked up by Sel as well. But Standy Red plays really three. selfish, extremely Standy selfish. doing everything really defensively to hold this inside of this. There's nothing wrong with that play, though. It's just the way Standy they will kill they the, the entire squad. They really hold this off. Yeah, I think it's just a philosophy because, you know, some teams, what they might do is spawn up troop side and try to work all the way back junk because they're trying to force the close red spawns, right? Just over and over and over again where I think their thinking is if we go through the middle of the map back alley, we get onto the point, you kind of just leave that person out of it. Yeah. Only two games today, Jack. On four, we already got to see Vista. Shout it's out just, to fucking this match. Really we had to see Vista map one. Of it. It was a really fun yeah, match to watch. Like, ex extremely to dope. No, no, uh, I think you and I have talked about, like, sort of their offensive fun, Like, a super fun map to watch. Like, on land, like, it just never two top four like they teams, looking for. banger. Whereas other teams are better. Just so, and we get to see Six Star in the next series, Chad. If you never watched Six Star, the next series will be the first thing we have to watch in a professional setting. have control, and then things unravel eventually. Yeah. They're never able to get to that. Standy will be on four in a row because he kind of wipes everybody out. His streak is high as accuracy is total kill count to this point. There's number five now for Standy. Deady up, looking to hunt. Maybe take a little confidence from that round win, especially maybe for Standy as he got all the kills. But uh, as the team drops around him, he's able, we to saw the right. They're able to find that cruise. Now one team in on the point, just kind of looking over him, locked it down middle of the alley. Accuracy was trying to work his way over towards B. Same with the rest of the team now, trying to fly on through. Team kill does come on in, but there's those. We're not gonna see this as anymore. That's gonna be so weird. Two on two goes the way of Rocker. B is open. See, this Draza is the situation I was talking about. Teddy. You're able to cut them out. If draws the dice here without now. getting a, getting a kill, it gets scary for face. Oh, I Pops too. Yeah, that's the, the worst case scenario. Literally the worst shit. Somebody, if you were cell, so you were able to try that. He was gonna Did get a shoot. Death. I, yeah, I thought like I don't know. He just turns. It was like he got high alert. Yeah, and that's what it looked like. <laughs> I was just like looking at the mini map and just seeing how that like little skirmish played out as well. But yeah, I guess. Either he shot or he heard something. It's yeah, he just yeah, snapped. Because I was thinking if he died there, that's Showman's. an even bigger opening for them to push through. But somehow this sort of, you know, it looked crazy for a moment. You get, uh, get back to calm here if you're facing. 
Yeah, have a player on bridge locking down top three. That's gonna Lamar be is lagging the Here's fuck the out as Pierce has does get on to A. Triple his kills. I really did look like a mini map with high alert snap. Who does it? Damn, no, Tyler! He somehow wins that, so. Now you have a chance to get done with A, and you're already on the B, so a big one on one win. He only had six kills, but that one was massive. Oh, because er was everyone's there. having a lag out moment this game. Sim, just able to finesse. The rest of the team comes through with kills as well. You have what? You just need half Wait, a Wait, six days? Is it J? Done. You're all spawning up close to red, though, so you're probably thinking we got to hit B from this position, and they try to power it on through. Sells me the one up top of the eyes. Gunless has already got tags into him. He's in a challenge, and Gunless will get the headshot. The Mars so playing like Beautiful win there. Back over to Draws we go. He, he has that. rival wow. in hand, but accuracy puts him in the dirt. Slams him with the MCW. It's Sims' turn to try and fly in. That's not going to work out. And this is bad. This is exactly what the map is cut in half. So let's see what uh, Tyler well. can do. So Tyler has to win the gunfight. Here? You're already going to rate the spot, though, yeah. see off of it. You're going to have to give up B. So great job by Rocker. They get those close red spawns. kind of what we talked about coming in on. Just flood it. Yes. I know, Travis. I'm, I'm, I'm still, still going to say what I said. I think I'm a big Lynch fan still, man. Of players that I've never spoken to before. Now a tick to work with that A. Here comes the streak as well. You just want to shut this down. Take the 2-1 edge. If you are able, looking and hunting, not hitting, but the teammates are, you just have one player Ooh, on a big team. That's a huge okay, team kill. That team kill is actually so impactful. Comes in, so Standy tries to track back to it. So, so close. Contest is in. Right yeah, over that's a big team kill. That might have cost him the round. Oh, he's nah. Poor Pierce, bro. He just team kills kill. so bad. You've cleared off that progress now, so they have to get the entire tick. You have no respawns remaining. It's a five versus four. We're basically into a search and destroy round. Five in a row and a chance for a streak now for Gunless. But do a 4v4 we go. Or sorry, 5v3 we go off the kill point, from Draza. Bro. Who, Nate? Pierce, come on, twin. You know. Yeah, I lost They're getting run. picked apart. Draza, another big one here. He's on three in a row late and on 22, leading everybody in the lobby. You use a cruise here. Gunless is able to earn another one. Does he want to go for the round win, or are they just going to be happy with this? Looks like accuracy going to drop onto the A point or near it. Now one on three for Gunless. There's no time either. Nice gunfight win, but three seconds to go. Nothing he can do. You'll take a seven spree into the next one, but... Wait, that's accuracy just, team so Pierce? I thought that was wait, I thought like, that was backwards. Uh, round that would have cost Rocker a map, like because they team killed the round one. I thought that it was skip, Pierce like, team killed my bad. Just a very but winnable one. Whatever team killed, I, I, I thought it was they the other way around. Losing it, and I'm like, oh, it's another one for Rocker. <laughs> well, it, you know, really, it's that team Nate. Obviously, there's a skirmish going down on the A point. You had Standy pushed up red, and he kind of has to leave his spot because the team Nate on a uh, accuracy throws it on one of his teammates. Obviously, doesn't mean to do that, but it connects, and that kind of Forces yeah, Sandy Lamar to have to back up to the point. He no point longer five has the mid-map And cost it around single-handedly. That is Gives really tough. Control. No, it's like one domino falls and the other dominoes have to move as well. Because <laughs> just <laughs> the impact. But you're right onto it early. A little fake here on A. I mean, really, you just put one player on it and then this is a three-man B hit. So Sim's like, all right, I'm sacrificing my life. Good luck, gentlemen. Yeah, no, honestly, yeah, just throw him right into the pit. <laughs> and then everybody else is going to go to B. And this is well where they kind of struggled. You know, after they got that opening on to A, was the pressure here. Ooh, so they're thinking, Let's good just check go from right Lamar, away. though. Nice little jump shots there from Lamar, though. Through the mid-plus window. Hard gunfight really hard gunfight. Abisi and Sim, though, the tiny tears, they're doing their thing. Draws has gotten into help as well. He's now on four in a row. As he I don't really know if he's MC is running. Uh, he's won the tail end of that round from a standpoint. MC is running quick, quick grip gloves, Second bit of progress is done. Draza is still dancing, yeah, dipping, diving with death. Yeah, he is. Trying to just play his oh, life and the help is there. That's Draza, too. They're both running. They're contested the fuck? through for a moment. You're not quite out of it yet. Yeah, just now where is this player? And while he gets his right, it is Standy, though. There is the trade. Almost wins the second one. But Abizi now on to the point. And again, just keeping this messy is Atlanta phase. One more challenger. And the timing just a little bit off for a BZ, so accuracy and Lynn's lockdown B. Yeah, I mean, Selwa got to the balcony, was just trying to get whatever shots in he could, but. Let's look at Pierce's arrow chat. I want to see what he's doing. Couldn't really like, help, but based on some of the angles, it looks like, like he has a 2KD, bro. How, what's going on? For a BZ, but. Your second bit of progress is done now at A. You need one tick on either side. Clean shots from Draza from the pit. Rotating over the other end of it is simple. Uh, now this is just, yeah, a little bit of. Uh, a little bit of mess, a little uh, bit of aggression that you couldn't really six. find in the first offensive take to your face. 
Yeah, I mean, now just with one tick left, you have a five life advantage, and you kind of play the way they they want to. That's true. Just, just really you isn't kill her. Like like from Celia. playing his life as much as it looks like. Looks like read it. He does, but that'll be the first domino. He's just not getting. Any, no one's really hitting his land right towards there. Towards ticket, able to find the first, and that's gonna slow things down. So not out of this one quite yet. That was really nice timing on the peak there, just with kind of selling the BZ. Pitching backside of the diner. Make that push a little bit easier. <laughs> From dumpsters, it can be so, so difficult. Abizi's Infinity. being stunned up by everything. He's like, my knees, I tore my hamstring. I tore my hamstring, but I'm still able to slide. Oh, he almost snaps onto another one as well, but he'll be taken out for now with 90 seconds to go. And now they're kind of put in this position again. Spawning up deep over towards Coop's side, but just often a fight through top red and the balcony, but that's going to be I think I know who Travis is talking Maybe about. Travis, we defending a brother. Yo, to right. end this match. Yeah, you got that close. Lamar, 14 and 23 right now. Uh, still a he's chance to bounce back after to costing his team around by team killing the in the clutch. Raza, and now you've lost Simp. Oh, he's, still just just that is he's, looking at, he's looking at Pierce, bro. Like, yo, he is tweaking. Honestly, twin. you've done a pretty good job with this if you're a rocker. Yeah. Like, nice retake. Nice job dealing with the aggression. Now you're kind of back to step one in a way. You've at least got bodies over towards that red side push. You can still hold this. Will it come down to lives though? We'll see. Nice double jump. Yeah, I think base is just gonna try to, to get out trying no to damage. hit this, make it messy again. Rockter trying to slow it down as much as possible. 45 seconds left. Both team just hunting, hunting through red, checking all of their corners. Idraza, he's gonna find two. 29 and 19 for him. Trying to find a 30 bomb and the match win with the big 3-0. There's always just one more player for Rocker, and they have done a good job so far. Any time he can stop this clock, though, is this great. Is Any contested right now. time just allows them to maybe Tyler, take Tyler. this to lives. Every Tyler, Tyler. single second, he's able to stay on the point. Draws a it went big at the tail end. 6v3, chat. 6v3. Good job here. Staying up. Lamar, the best the player is dead, though, sadly. Three lives remaining for Rocker. Linz has got the entire Atlanta phase team yes. about to drop kick him. He drops Standy and Gunless trying to stand strong. Not quite able to do it. It's all on Standy. Welcome back to the league. Good oh, luck, sir, as he's done it so far. Five seconds to go somehow standing with seven hp is able to get out close red spawn they're right under the point with another one. one no way no way Did one versus chance? one i can tell him oh yo god sandy nearly does you it. learn from him that chat you learn from insane. him look at lamar lamar bro, I, I, I don't know who should one, i don't even know who to drop so anymore bro this damn camera <laughs> started with I was like welcome back to the league it's like all four were flying and then suddenly it's a 1v1 inside a diner yeah unfortunately for him those close red spots came in so yeah. he gets the one on two he, he makes the heads up decision I can't allow them to group up they're weak they're stunned takes the first one on two repositions but then the second players are already on to the point and yeah. I think if it's probably any other player than M MC, he might have a, a better chance because he's the one who ends his <sighs> clutch in the search as well That's yeah funny. no like in that spot where you have a rival versus an MCW, like most other MCW players, maybe it wasn't his kills though, Travis. Okay, he literally yeah, costed them round four. Maybe the hardest kill in the game. <laughs> that's just that's that's the guy. I hope it's not. He clutches up. You want that? This series like, three. We're nitpicking the play, but like if he doesn't team co right there, they win that five hundred damage. In the moment, it's chaotic. You know, started you know, whatever, a little rough. He literally keep unlucky. This team. We're talking very early in this twenty twenty four season. He keeps playing. He still could have lost round Ooh. five, but he definitely yeah, costed them that round four. The respawn, you, you saw. Talk their P over Lamar. I mean, Gunless, <laughs> we lie. As well. like, this is what we're talking about. There is some firepower there, some individual talent. We saw multiple times from Standy in the search in some of these 1vx scenarios. Almost does it towards the end of that round. Just a, a tough couple of first matches for Rocker. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's a tough time. draw, is what it is. You got to play phase by the way, but hopefully just for them. You know, I know they're, they're obviously scrimming and stuff, but it's not the same as playing it, you know, in the kind of live match <coughs> atmosphere like this. So you go back with the staff, you work on some things, you try to improve, you can listen back. Uh, I mean, well, at least for us, like the listening we heard was pretty solid, though. I like yeah. what I heard considering the team has just been banded together just needs the same way the past couple of weeks. But uh, that'll do it for Joe and I in our first match uh, to break down the action. We get it back to our incredibly attractive desk and especially our host, Chris Puckett. Oof.
Thanks, Maven. Appreciate that gas, buddy. Let's take a look at the Andy action. Alex Pierce got down. She had a, she had a quick three with Rocker. series from Atlanta phase. And Allie, yeah, the Rocker you chose Rocker. Minnesota Rocker. You looked really smart for the first half of that real hard point. <laughs> yeah, really smart for the first half of that real hard point. Again, it real was hard point. We smoking. Like, we we smoking. We. It could be one of those honeymoon things where they catch the major two winners off guard. We've seen it happen in the past. Unfortunately, it doesn't come to fruition in this series as Atlanta phase holds strong. Specifically, Yo, the new strong. He was simply that guy in match number two and number three but for Minnesota Rocker I don't think you walk away from this that upset the map one you had a lead majority of the game even in the map three like there are moments when that sliver didn't finish the gap on a where you could have gone up two and one is just important and that's the question I had for you nameless as a former pro player you've been in the shoes of accuracy as soon as the series was yeah. over he flips his camera right yeah. he just knocks it off says I'm done we're done with this series everyone kind of storms out of the practice room are you worried about Rocker Rocker's reaction. This is your first match, and you lost to the champions of the previous major. No, I, I think that that indicates that they probably had some pretty good practice. Okay. There are a couple moments throughout the series where maybe they made mistakes that they had in practice. They thought they went over. That wouldn't happen in a match, and it probably happened, right? The growing pains of being a Call of Duty team. To me, what that shows is that they felt like they really could have came in and I'm won this series. Body. I'm just shooting bodies. I'm just You think about that Vista Hardpoint, super close, right? Yeah. Like, they could have won it. Gummas played great throughout the entire series, even in that control. Just some tough situations situations coming down to 1v1s, right? So uh, I wouldn't read too much into that, but like, I'm just gonna reiterate, Gunless played so good throughout this series. 26 like, and 15 that game, 3, 5,800 damage. Mm -hmm. Pierce has been the real deal, and he's yeah. showing up where you wanted him as a slayer. How did the team look as a whole though, Allie? As a whole, I thought Sandy Gunless personally played very, very well off of each other. Again, the start of that real Vista Hardpoint was beautiful for Minnesota Rocker. They had just started lacking on the fundamentals a little bit as Atlanta Faye started coming back in the slaying department. Nameless today, we got our scuff play of the game, and it's Draza. Can you give me some play-by-play -play of one man. of the biggest trash talkers in the league? Yeah, I'm assuming it's gonna be from this control, and it's just Draza lighting up, man. Every single time they needed him to make a big play and buy the team some time, he did it. Finds the player on the A point, kills the guy top three, and then claims the space up top three. Now, next match, let me open my title shot. Next match is uh, Las Vegas Legion versus the LA Gorillas chat. Is, this match is going to include a uh, six-star map one and Vista map one. So we get to watch more new maps. More confident and comfortable as the series go on. So for Jaws, yeah, perfect spot for him. And now they're really starting to hit their stride. 6,500 damage basically in that game three. And that will seal the deal on Atlanta's first qualifier match. They finish with another W. And I believe they're now over the 300 point mark on our leaderboard. We'll get to that a little bit later. But right now it's time to talk with the man. Interview, in our interview. monster winner spotlight. Welcome back, Big Abe. Interview, Beezy's interview. on the show. And we got to ask about this matchup. What was it like? See what I was saying. See what I was saying. We Lock haven't in. seen in the CDL in a minute. Uh, I mean, it feels good. You know, I played against him back in like BO4, like uh, all those days back when he was on like LG and stuff. Mm -hmm. So it was cool seeing him back on the battlefield, you know? Absolutely. And I speaking of roster changes, you played him in Vanguard what team do you World think World made the best move like during these past two weeks? Back in BO, I played him back in mm. BO4. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like everyone outside the top four is in a really tough spot as it is, to be honest. So I don't, I don't think there's really anyone that made like a good change. I feel like. Fair enough. Jesus. Uh, BZ, listen. I know the respawn's been great for you guys, uh, and I know that when we sub maps in and out, it comes down to a vote, right? For you guys, we got Vista and we got Six Star. I'm feeling like you guys were very excited about getting these added to the map pool. Is that so? Oh yeah, we were super excited because I feel like. Some of the maps in the pool were just kind of cheese, I feel like. So I feel like getting newer maps in, especially that have like good flow and like they're like kind of like three lanes. There's like a bunch of cuts and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's going to help a lot with me and Chris running around with subs. Yeah. Do you do you feel like the current meta is like the best it's ever been for an SMG? Is that fair to say in the CDL era? Uh, in the CDR, I don't know. I mean, I think it's a lot better now because four, like major one, major two, a lot of people are running like three ARs on a lot of maps, maybe even four, depending on the map. But I feel like it's nice now being able to run that like main sub and actually be able to use it and not have to like switch on and off between an AR. Yeah. Uh, BZ, can you give some pro tips to the kids in my lobby tonight? When I'm playing ranked and I'm playing on Vista, and I'm playing on six star, what is the one thing that you would give advice to for anyone trying to pick up the new game? I mean, just try to learn the spawns the best you can. I think there's a few crazy ones on 6-star, but I feel like Vista's a lot of fun to play. 
We had fun watching you, man. A great hard point to open the series, and we'll see you later this weekend. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you. Kids on my team. Hope we stop by secret. We still have another match to yeah. go. Before we finish this matchup, though, final thoughts on Minnesota. I know it was a brief. I chat, I'm gonna go pitch. I'm gonna come right back. Team. Yeah, First match, DoorDash match. Chat. The, the stream has only been live there, about an hour. So we got that was a very, very fast back shot match. Battle. We come back. We got a close one according to the standings. It's LAG taking on Vegas Legion. The party continues live from Columbus, Ohio. Awesome. Chat, not the sport chat too. I heard a few things about both of these teams. So I'm so assuming they need to both have a really good weekend in order for every, everything to stay the same. You Start know what I'm saying? The season strong. It's both the, before the this match, or before the, the event, LAG was on an 0-7 loss streak. Vegas is coming off an absolute mental breakdown against Toronto and Carolina. So I'm, I'm really hoping that Vegas plays good. I'm really hoping Evan plays good. I don't want anything crazy to happen uh, during these qualifiers. I want my dog to have a another chance to show how good he can be. You know what I'm saying? Even though, you know, they did kind of break down against Carolina and against fucking uh, Austin. Pretty bad. I was like, I'm gonna go piss him. I'm gonna come right back. I'm gonna get some more water too, because the brother's kind of thirsty. You know what I'm saying? I'll be right back one second. It's a statue for ants. <laughs> 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 what the fuck that they did my man mad wrong yo you should alan, see the statues out here alan iverson is a fucking that shit's legend tiny. and they did him like that come on philly yeah his shit's supposed to be what tiny, it's supposed to be his height or taller yo yeah that they, shit's tiny yeah man they did him wrong man such a one of my favorite uh ball players from back in the day i had them i had them rebucks with the honeycomb. That's the man, Chuck. Ah. Look at that crossover, man. I mean, to scale, his is well, definitely. Yeah. Ah, uh, come yeah, on. Yeah, they got man. some legends, man. Yeah, they do. They got some legends. Yes, they do. Uh. Igor said, love the collab with my favorite football team. How cool is the Juventus Stadium? Any merch dropping soon? Uh, yes, 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 and yes. Oh, shit. Yes, yes, yes. Some 990 V6s? Uh, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Like, I, 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 uh, I don't know. To answer your question, the stadium was insane. The match was insane. Uh... Yeah, everything about that trip was amazing. I can't, I can't name one negative from that trip. Literally, besides actually the trip, the the actual flight, and the flight time. That's the only negative. But when we were there, it was amazing. Everything was amazing. I'm not gonna lie, the 20 hour travel day was tough. Though. Oh my god, so tough. That shit was tough. It was so tough. It was tough. And that's a great picture. I mean, look at the boys, dude. We had we had a time, didn't we? We did. We had dude, a great time. Dude, we had a blast. Bose didn't want to go. Maniac didn't want to go. Snoozers. We had a fucking uh, great time. Huh? Don't worry. It's all good. It's a, yeah, it's all good. You didn't want to go. It's all good. It's crazy. Yo, Bo, so what what uh What do you think? What uh I'm gonna get him some runners. But I gotta get him something that he can wear in the daily. Um Oh my God! I'm gonna get a, what? Throw some dunks. I'm gonna get him one of my favorite shoes of last year, the 860 V2 by Amelion Door. Wait, let me see what they look like. It's the ones that you like. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. West Side said Concord 11s. Oh yeah, those are fire. No, no, no Jordans, no Jordans. Nah, nah, because they're not gonna lace them right. No. Are Concord 11s nice? Oh yeah, my one of my favorite shoes. Really?
I just had him on the podcast. Oh, no, me, me and Fred just did the eavesdrop. And we were talking about shoes. And I'm, I'm going to get you, I'm gonna get you a, a, a set. He's going to put these on, and he's just going to be like, Zid, say, wow, bro, I've never worn such comfortable shoes. Those are some Air Maxes, heck? No, uh, New Balance. No, those oh, are these? Yeah. They're the first ones ever. Bro, bro, I've never... Air Max One. I've never had comfortable shoes like this, bro. All shadows, Air Max One. Oh, it's nice. But it's Air Max Day. I'm glad they brought this shit back. And this is new, by the way. Right? No, we saw this at the major. Never mind. Did you see it, mate? Hello, G. I'm so happy they brought back the OG song. Same. They know we love it. They know it. Mm -hmm. Yo, yo, Hector, what are these shoes called, bro? These are, I'm gonna think I'm on a cloud, bro. Floating. <laughs> floating. I think I'm floating, bro. Do you hear what he said about your impression? Mm -hmm. like, so it was good, right? Oh, yeah, so good. He said he, he gasses you, man. Yo, Chad, I actually have a question for you. Uh, are y'all getting packet, uh, packet loss on ranked? Or is it just me? Because I we played ranked for like what three hours this morning, and the whole time, every single game we were in, I had pack Every nice. game. I've been playing I've been Resurgence. Been There's no way it's my. Internet. I've been playing Resurgence. There's no <laughs> way. If it's my internet, I'll be tight. <laughs> Dude, that is unacceptable. Look at that. Yeah, no, that's a All fact. All these people are lagging in game. The I, whole I, fucking I, day. I hopped on to play uh, Resurgence with the boys from from back home. I was done after the first night. Dude. Everything was laggy. It was like nonstop lag. There he is. There he is. Money. Solar. Money solar. <laughs> Money solar. Money clips. Get it? Yeah. Good. Who, who plays tomorrow? What's the CDL schedule the CDL? tomorrow? Wait, yeah. Did you guys see that? Any, solar any, any good matches tomorrow, Chad? I don't think there's any like bangers yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, we saw it in New York. We saw partial. For real? Yeah, we did. Everybody was cheering and shit like, yeah. yeah, there was one guy. There was one guy walking and he was like, is Taylor Swift out there? Dude, he was so what? unfunny, He kept man. saying it. And there's like a bunch of people lined up in the airport. He's like, is Taylor Swift out there? Say, keep it. Keep going, buddy. What? Boston, Miami. I would have just been like, dweeb, get this guy out of the airport. New York, Minnesota. Cancel his flight. Lose his fucking bag. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's a freak. Yeah. He said it like three times, too. <laughs> nobody <laughs> reacted to him. Like Literally that. nobody <laughs> looked at him. <laughs> Wait, dude, did you, see, did you see AG was bugging about it? What? He was like trying to put up his blinds and shit. He was scared of it, of the eclipse. He, to, he, he didn't know what's happening. He didn't know what it was. He was like, "What the fuck?" And he put his blinds up. He was trying to like close his. Receiver I'm back, window. Chad. I'm back. 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 Oh my God! Please respin, bro. That team is ass. Alec Afro. Jesus. This is insane. God, motherfucker, that is crazy. You can't leave the setup, bro. This what I got? What I got? Face. I didn't what I got, what I got. Oh my god. god. Big ass boy. It's full, by the way. Look at this ball. This is make it just look at my hand. Full. Full. It is literally up to the brim. You see that? And his buddy chance. Da, 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 da. Can we do that on air? Probably not. Anyway, Probably not. We're Imagine that'd be fire, bro. The, the, the king of Adam, me personally? Oh my god, I'd be fucking. He's gonna change things uh, in a big, big, big way. You're going crazy. to get the series started, though. Chance, how did Lee Doodley? I, Daddy, yeah, no, dope. I got no Simpsons references for that, unfortunately. But I'm excited. We get a six star first thing, and we get to take a look at the beautiful water off the other Gorgeous. side of the map. And so my lock in. It is just for the fact. First time watching six star chat. God bless. Point, I think maybe twice in the past like two or three days. I'm excited just to get that like look on the mini map, so I can actually take the time and utilize it for my own rank like play performances. Oh, yeah. So I'm excited just for the. I don't know if the word I use is good. We got a lot of looks here. Brand new map here. You know what I want. 
one of those folks who've been joined the 24 Shit. 7 playlist in uh, MW. Bucket of KFC, no, I'm just kidding. Fans in that one, but pizza, what a pizza gorgeous map. Shout out to the uh, map designers there at uh, Sledge. Who the hell, how do you get up to that piano? It's a Didn't lovely bit of ground. Piano there. Never noticed it. <laughs> it's a gorgeous piano into the first hard point we go, and there is a nice shot. Nice. Across the entirety of the bar, seeing where those maze land. But all aboard the fame train, so far is he in the point. Yeah, that is a perfect look of them missing every single syntax right there. Just by a little bit, I think they would have connected on the guy in the window if not. But either way, LAG going to take full advantage. Good timing on the double child. And just like that, nice little P1 push through. Opening breaks always going to be a, a tone setter. And again, miss nades by Vegas. Well, it's going to cost him at least a little bit of time. There's a lot of uh, different places to hide here in this bar. It's a wonderfully vibey location. And I'm sure with the airflow from that nice outdoor pool section, yeah. it's allowing fame to run around the point to keep finding these kills down a purge the last man up there for L for vegas legion is lag maintain a wonderful control over p1 though chance the rotation's almost done oh, to to the the i'm sorry i don't remember what this one's called but is it looks like pinching? a nice little padded room the you fuck? Sit down why would he do that i don't know have a drink and tell I'm a bugging? fun story here on six star man just that room with all the vent access but there's fame showing off a nice little nerd spot by yeah the old infinity pool, Dinner, but those were some two weird spawns that came through with the white time on p1 that actually set vegas up with a really good break and pinch opportunity but they don't really make anything happen and while diamond con's trying to climb nero as pointed out by nameless that's what i wanted to see him being a rat in you hark a preference we pick up one player though on, as the swarm around time continues that's a consistency on, players trying to use that spot to pop up, but Dolphin that really finesse perfectly. too good Dolphin that finesse getting the kills getting the trades and getting that hill time plenty of hidey holes in this hard point my brother Lots come on Good coverage there from the outside by Geo, not to get the kills. I mean, they are now up close and personal in this assault. They managed to punch a hole through the defense. DC on the outside, another body into the pool. Ooh! Oh dear, Purge, what a two-piece. Back and oh, alive and kicking, not for long though. Diamond that. Con managed to get it. And once again, a strong but not massively profitable hard point there from LAG. We now go from one bar to the infinity pool to the next bar. Up top, left-hand side of the mini-map, open for business. Yeah, and this is a nerd spot to have. Geo just going to be the waiter inside the, well, pool at least, but he gets chopped down. You also teammate. had, by the way, Nero playing very deep and distant in his spawn to make sure to lock down the spawns good, and really good, you don't the get spawns and the opposing team. And really, you just funnel into what? Two directions? Attach has the hop up. Purge has an incredible head glitch uh, over towards that left ramp. So this is looking like a, a pretty perfect setup. Oh, and no. again, Geo just playing so distant. Might get caught down, but that should be easy trades for his teammates. Nero just Nero right around, or maybe you know. Fame will just break it down. Hey, fame train right in. Clean break. LAG, your hard point, no questions asked. Looking at the lead change in a brief moment. Vegas on the slow approach from down low. They're going to be coming out of that. They're going to have a free rotation, though. Shaky legs. Can they get towards this, the hard this, point? This, to me, might be to cut off will probably be one of the money holes on this map, so let's see if I'm right. Low side of the big statue. Again, another very, very naughty spot to be in. Plenty of angles of attack on these hard points. Let's see how our teams doing. hold it. Her, please yeah, don't I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to just you can change my eating habits. There this go. time as well. No one on LAG is going for it just yet, but definitely caught me off guard the first thing <laughs> that happened to me. So. Always got to pay attention to little things. Yeah, yeah, a couple of players might be coming across. That is so cheese. That is so cheese. Choo -choo all aboard. Will he be derailed? No, he will not. Nero oh, I should have popped up earlier. Shots right into attach as well. Not enough for the kill. Teammates are there for it. Three once again. LAG with another outstanding break. Nameless. The pick might start to look a little dangerous. Oh, well, speaking of things that are dangerous, not those doors. They will block every single bullet. No questions asked. So one of those awkward moments where players just having stay. Handoffs. But either way, Vegas are kind of struggling in this game. It feels like LAG just able to bully their way through the front. But I suppose the one solid hold that Vegas had, it's at least on the crazy. previous hill, is Water hill, bro. that they Mean still hill. have the lead. So I know Gorilla's been wheeling and dealing, but now we get to test their swimming boots and goggles. Fame on point already. But that sort of first blood as the noon time pops. And you see how distant every single spawn right now is from Vegas. It's a long ways away before they can break this hill. Yeah, it's a long way to go. What well, we put to test the swimming skills, shades of raid, shades of MW2, and why well, you want to get that pistol out. The purge fight down low is attached, going to be in there as well. Then I'll help get the time. 
How long can Purge hold his breath for? At this point in time, quite some time. Oh, Gio on out. six spree. That's going to be streaks here on six. Well, Gio draw that. Well, Gio, you were gassing him up. Open map indeed, and plenty of open angles to get those cruise missiles in on the up out of nowhere, bro. He was literally so negative. Where everybody was trying to oh. look into the water and really staring down. So Gio just capitalizes, takes full advantage. And more water fights. The pistol, yep, going to be maybe king in that environment. So Purge does give you the extra one, but all things considered, near tied up game. I don't think any true like full 60 or money hills have been discovered just yet. So we're just gonna have to square up back over towards P1. Purge doesn't have any help, wants to play an off angle and get out with his life. And well, he does get traded, but just trying to buy his teammates some time. Tyber though, Chad, just, next just buying line. time is so important in this shit, bro. Let's see if the nades are a little bit better this time around Vegas first go around. Not massive work out of LAG, but Vegas with a slight lead to work with now as Geo slowly roaming the halls, doing it silently. Wonderful work. Cuts the LAG defense in half, finds another kill, keeps his boys alive. Oh, that's perfect too as well. At least no. on the Geo side of things, or maybe you will get opened up, force him to turn around and nice little swarm around the zone. Nero, though, last or mono around that's Adam. the he point, react. able to Adam, pick Adam up likes. three. And well, that's going to seal the deal potentially for these final 20 seconds. LAG maybe going to have to chalk it up and focus over towards new. They're going to have all bodies near the point, but Fame just gets caught sliding for free and... Depending on where he spawns, it could get spicy, but nope, right back with his teammates towards that new time. We'll go. New time. Purge trying to find the entry through one of the many vents. Nero backing him up. Five spree for him. Can we get ourselves another pair of streaks to play with here for Vegas? New hard points up. That tiny little couch room. No one at home. Assault's going to try to get the time. Cut down by Geo again. 18 and 11. Not enough to get the next. Nero, can he get the streaks? Here's the game. Ooh, the gunfight of fame from behind. Slows it down. Can't get to the 150 mark. LAG, can you get back in the game now? Well, close side spawns right now, buying them that extra lifeline for the hill time thus far. Yeah, get, get read that, get read that for his moment, him and Attach working together, and well, that's the bait ah, to get Purge nearby. He delivers you from two, and Attach now now he gets over the back. he'll bait right, so for you. A clean break there by Vegas Legion. And it looks like they are reading the spawns as well, or maybe not. They're just covering every single vent, every single angle. It's Purge right now, you see in the hill. He is in hell. Oh, Geo! Can't get any more out of it. Nero up next. One, two, no problem. The third, not going to happen. Fame keeping it going. Attached with the last cut off kill. Numbers there for Vegas. Back and forth we go. The final that's seconds rookie, of the hard come to an explosive close. Once again, over to the bar here in the second set. Yeah, and LAG, you see this time, they're going to be fighting for these back spawns as well. They're taking the, the real dead routes to try to make it happen. Ooh! Oh, heads one up. bullet! He's one bullet! That push. Diamond can now be last him. man standing. And I think Vegas eight, maybe though, number eight, though. lost yeah. counter. Maybe Purge off spawn can pick him up for the trade. So Vegas, they handle and Purge especially that pressure perfectly. And I go right back to the same standard setup they had the last go around. Filthy head glitches to watch one angle in an actual power position from Geo to watch the hop up. This is looking nearly impossible to break down. Nigh on impossible fame eradicated over 200 points for Vegas Legion. The business end is well in the said earlier. Still, LAG and Vegas. For Geo. We'll I've see had one player struggling. Play, but at this point in time, it doesn't feel too necessary. So for, Purge, for, for mid -map, um, Adam, a dangerous place to be indeed for the members don't, of They LAG. don't care if they're Geo getting top six, bro. They're getting shit on online. Three in the spree. They're just having difficulty really stabilizing at any given moment. Fame maybe I heard there was a chance that you know something that could sense, change if you didn't play this weekend. Fame, by the way, we'll 25 see. kills out of assault. Nine and 19 right now. Tenth, so there's a slang problem. There is a beautiful look of the cruise wow. missile. That is so much extra map space. And well, you know that or HGO for sure. Without the middle of time, but LAG now just going to have to worry about those split spawns that are coming through. And here we go. Fame, you've been stunned. Can you win the fight? You can. Big win. Gorillas holding it together. Finding the kills. Estrella can't get it done. A few moments to break. LAG. Let's go for a quick listen in. I'm 
He pops two in the water. He just popped two in the water. I'm 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 Kitty, Kitty dead. Try help you, Kitty. Hey, one more P2. He's in here, P2. Front P2. Try and help. Oh, I'm in. 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 I'm I mean, surely not, right? They're not going to make this comeback. Wait, wait, this might get shysty. I'm not going like to lie. All of a sudden, here we are. Thought we were trolling with the listening, but LAG orchestrating a comeback, but holding P1 seems incredibly difficult. You got mm. Vegas taking all sorts of routes. But they're going one by one. No. Nothing but purple. Oh. These boys are holding on. They're in Diamond Con. Stops the time. Oh, and unfortunately, another wedding, another wedding, keeps another it wedding. going now. All down to a sword. Ray tree, how's the tree that? Backs him up from fame. Keeps the play alive. There's the contest. Nero finds the pinch. Oh, nearly the second. It's a Vegas hard point. Five seconds. Get the quick contest. DC's there. Attach. Can't get it done. Game still no. going. We're going towards new. It's going to be a P2. No, not my Vegas. dog. Not my dog, bro. Not even be there first. Number five and number seven is Salt Mestrial. The opportunity to at least make a dent. Oh, the one shot. Oh, the one shot. Literally, both of them are one shot. Purge is going to fall. LAG desperate. Hours, but they can make this happen. Send it. They cut down a tash. Shiro's gone for the two. Quick fight. There's a good test. No hope. Two Shiro's in the vents. Great work. Fame on the pinch. It should be done. No way. No how. <laughs> oh, what a they got a little size end. Vegas Legion. Take map number one. Brand new map and a brand new mustache on Adam Assault as well. Caught me off guard just like that comeback did. I was thinking on P1, surely going to be too mixy of a hill, too much contest time going through. Vegas, if they get the opening, maybe pop off and make it happen. But LAG, they simply had that fight in them. And I think when we uh, take a look at that sort of like hill by hill breakdown, I think it was like the P3s for Vegas that were Are really the standout moments. Uh, outside of that, it certainly seemed like LAG were fighting. Two people had less damage than enemies. The full case, spectrum bro. of that map as well. Some of those water fights were just atrocious to look at. This the bullets seemingly not connecting. So uh, yeah, maybe no true Aqua men in this lobby haven't cracked that code just yet. <laughs> I don't know, mate. I think Purge is our front runner for uh, King of the Seas. He took yeah, what looked like two full bursts from the Renetti and then beat that player down. That was something. Lots to learn, guys. Once again, we thought. I mean, you were, I, you mean I guess it's, it's, it's simple as this land, right, Travis? Like, well, Hydro, the spiritual success. It's lives really tough to drop somebody because they're doing good on land. But Travis, there, there's a chance that something happens this weekend, depending on how both of these two, these two teams play. Because I think everyone that got 12 made a change, right? Seattle, Seattle, Boston, Thieves. Who else got 12? Like we've had one water map it seems like every year for the past however many years. I who's got 12. Like I just want to know what player is. I think everybody that got 12 got made a change. King Neptune, Aquaman, yeah. whatever title we want to give, it would be a fun one to have. Again, well, Miami, Miami, they made a change too. Like again, Vegas, it was 241 to legit, like what, 115, 120? <laughs> Purge is just, I don't know, playing a horror game inside of the water. My brother Pedro! Yo, hype, happy birthday, bro. I swear to God. Happy 18th birthday, hype. Let him have it. Like with it's the been a <laughs> it's been a pleasure uh, getting a chance to see you grow up these past few years. Uh, hype, no bullshit. Uh, hype, if you're gonna pursue what I think you want to pursue, hype, make sure you work very very hard, bro, and just realize that there is going to be at the moment it is not maybe it doesn't seem like it, but there's going to be a lot of lows and a lot of highs because you're pursuing something that is not linear. It, it, pursuing uh, hard is is the most unreal one of the most unrealistic things you can pursue. It's like pursuing what I'm to pursuing. It's not linear, bro. The the highs are gonna feel amazing, but the lows are gonna feel like it's GG's. So keep that in mind every time you're gonna if you're gonna pursue it, bro.
Oh, your birthday was yesterday? Same thing, bro. Not quite a full it, 60. They got about 45 seconds the first go around and effectively yesterday, got today, the same full thing, 60 buddy. second go around. That, I thought uh, you and birth and Lucas were twin end, birthday so twins. I'm nice. thinking when I play today? rank now, that's going to be a hill that I just hardcore rotate to. Played like Nero did. Just pushed in the depths of the back spawn and hopefully my tier eight teammates will make the uh, purge sort of plays. Lay down in P1. Let a couple guys run past. Pick up the, the sneaky two. But yeah, as you pointed out, we are going back to now the sort of standard section. The maps that we have the experience with, the karate Karachi S and D, uh, and I would simply say that one LAG really gonna want to get that quick bounce back from because these guys, it is just been an online to land difference. Yes, they are sitting in the top eight. They are in well, not a comfortable, but in a spot where they have that champ spot thus far. But if they keep having poor online performances, it is simply not gonna end up panning off for them in a positive way long term. So. They want to get these CDL points, and especially against a team like Vegas would be a great team to get 10 against. Yeah, we keep thinking about those sort of the race towards champs, the race towards staying in the top eight in the standings, and there's a couple of teams there that are sort of neck and neck, and we'll see that develop throughout the season. Again, we're over, the, over the halfway mark, it feels like, Chance, with Toronto on the horizon, quickly become one of our favorite 50 stops 50 here 50 in the cents, CDL I assume. 50 cents is like... Points, right? All that run towards champs, two teams that certainly want to make it. Two teams that want to turn the legacy of both of their respective organizations. Sir Wombo, we, we save it, money. One map at a time. Out of Rocker Luke. Um, they got 3 0 backsided. Here's what's good, round, though. If that's, that's an up, I think an upside. And while well, the biggest problem that they have had on this map is the. Lamar had a really, really bad series. He had like a 0.6, 0.7, something like that. They're constantly Maybe playing from behind, but also for the fact that Vegas have been incredible on attacking rounds. Definitely going to be something we uh, have to pay attention to. Uh, I know attach overall. I mean, you got to keep in mind every, every single that series has to be taken like from the coaching staff with a grain of salt. You're playing the major, the major two champs, the and they look like the best they've ever looked. Per rounds are up there, it's the best page look this is also a map since of purge. Likes to maybe play solo, likes to run around Old War. Down these you know, in round one. Coming back from no an event. Time wasted. Already cut off the middle of the map. And I mean, right now, he just commented to his teammates nobody crossed over towards bridge. If you get this bomb down, we're going to have a very comfy setup. Mm. Well, sweet time. Maybe, maybe, maybe the V side of the map for LAG. Eyes are on there for a moment. Here comes the quick shuffle. The purple arrows have moved. The play has been called. Purge might be in an Wombo, incredible spot to catch out like a couple that. on the so cross here. They're about to maybe hit that threshold. Escrow well, everyone that watches, the my, watches COD knows this is, my, this is the jet ski strat. This is the oh jet ski strat. It's going to come down to attach. Can he spot these players out? Looking for it. Might be able to get at least one. There's the first blood. Oh, well, yeah, surprise to attach. He got info on both of those players, though. So a big moment maybe for the intel. Downside is Purge is going to fall. That is oh a patient my game. goodness, fame just down. We got a 2v2 or maybe all up to Diamond Con and his position is known. Oh, he's moving though. He's managed to get himself out of that top window. Geo now has to guess a little bit. 20 seconds on it. Nero's managed to get himself towards top nah, third. He, he's he got didn't a like great right. spot he's on the spot. Diamond Con, no hope. I looked insane from his POV Geo though. did not need to guess. Nero was there for it. It was a lovely start there from Vegas. To watch it too, like, damn. That was a very interesting round, too. I mean, you basically had Vegas were, like, scared. I damn that big-ass water bottle, Evan. <laughs> Intel the entire time, but however the round pans out, this is literally the gunfight that was the difference maker. Fame from prone to standing took a little bit too long, and, well, Nero simply guns him down. So as interesting of a round one developed on a strat front. It is all up to Gunny in COD. Nero delivers. And Vegas, again, best team in the uh, league on attacking rounds on Karachi. They live up to that expectation there. Aim worthy enough to lift the bomb. Nades exploding across the map. Nothing too far these days. We say goodbye to Ordnance from the clubs. Purge gives Estri all the hands, though. Nero trying to back him up there in the kill feed. Pressure now on as Vegas oh, Legion. That's decisive. Oh, opener. Not enough to get the third, but there's the teamwork once again, and Fame finds himself completely alone and well and truly up the creek. Good job, uh, Burge, yeah, doesn't even waste time making sure he does not get a paddle. Takes him down. Easy reads there. And that just feels like the Vegas player is just able to run rampant. Just aggression through the middle of the map. The coverage is always perfect. Seems like a moment where Nero might just be doing some insanity sliding towards mid, but that's just because Attach was above him there for the easy trade. So wheeling and dealing as aggressive as you want him. Vegas on point. First blood's rolling through and really just even the capitalization of like the map control that what they can food, get boy. after they get the kills None pushed out. Purge goes from top AC, just ends up living in some random corner inside a coop. Keep that bitch clean. Always heads up gameplay off the rookie. 3-1 split here for LAG on defense. 
absolutely licked the clean. over the B-bomb site, and Nero, he's gonna hit that corner. What oh, hit fame as well. Nidig gets the second, Estra walks away with a bit of tam damage. Geo's there for the trade. A beautiful opening there for both teams. It's a 2-2. Turns the out into a 2-1. Of course, Evan that's Dyke's a alone. fucking... Yeah, that's the big difference maker gunfight there for Assault. He at least gives you the advantage. The question is, so when you're playing against Attach in a clutch situation, is it really an advantage to have that extra person? Plenty of time to break this down. He doesn't have the bomb. Just run like Sharky's bomb down he here. He at least up. has the covert sneakers. So Attach has one very small thing working for him. Everything else, the odds are massively against him. He's going to have to traverse water this water map water and oh, take care bro, of both the IR water players water. from LAG. And he simply has no intel. Hasn't heard a sound in the past 30 seconds. I know. Well, he's wearing the... Oh, okay. Diamond Con, still a shooter. I had a Harry Potter joke line up there, but you're going to have to wait for the next round, COD fans. Vegas, not unable to capitalize on that. The King of Clutch shut down. Diamond Con does it. His fourth kill in the map so far. I... Sitting at two deaths. How was a... Oh, that was a rival nine. I'm saying, it's it's the same shit I was about to say, like, uh, that's, that's certainly what it felt like. That, hey, one of those gunfights, Rob 9, pretty good gun. I am down for the propaganda on that front, but <laughs> either way, LAG, very solid round. They might not have gotten the first bloods, but it was just trades on trades. Oh. Estro cleans up the kill from his fallen flow. Uh, I think it was Diamond Con that traded him after the fact, after Geo got the trades, but Assault really wins the, the biggest gunfight of the round. Now LAG for the attack. Straight down mid. They got a ton of pressure and presence over towards A. Assault, another first blood. Attached from heavens above, though. Him and Geo work together. And that push might get stuffed. All these players getting caught out. And it is just gunny on gunny. No one's playing S D. Nice round of TDM coming through. Love a TDM, mate. Let's get my players left. Who's on Diamond streaks? Con 1v2 against Geo and Perch. Kind of on streaks. A minute to go. I want to be down He's one three, though, the so I think he plays the Vegas pressure. duo have gone towards B, leaving a wide open for now chance. But Diamond Con's taking his time, checks his mags. He's going to be sweet for the fight, but he has read this for a brief moment. What does he know that we don't? He's just uh -oh. playing patient. Wasn't patient enough, though. That timing was horrific. Call of Duty yeah. timing at its finest. He's the oh thing where he's God. like, oh, dude, I should have He's gone the wrong way now. No bomb. The lads are going to check the bomb site. They're going to see that the bomb's down. They've let a little bit of gunfire rattle across as we are desperately trying to get into the action and it's not going to happen. Purge and Geo, slow and steady win that race. This Diamond Con finds himself in a very tough one. And that's tough for Diamond Con because he was neither a rabbit nor a hare. He was actually making the correct heads up play call as well. Just spidey senses not tingling enough. And again, that is literally if he waits for another two seconds, maybe has the opportunity to make a play. But either way, for Vegas, their trades Actually, have just been surges, outstanding. Their teamwork is always there, even when attaches is Every game has a little bit of time. Top rope from a top bit of time Geo is yeah. still looking down from bottom green. So Vegas Legion right now, everybody around from the trades, teamwork flowing, and these guys have been fantastic. Yeah, Vista map four, so we, I'd like to watch a Vista, so if somebody could, three players crossing, whether it's Vegas it winning this map and them losing the next map, I want to see Vista. Burge has instincts. He's been playing the late flank over towards A. Meanwhile, Estriel in position. Just Big gets blood. caught and gunned down. Another first blood for Vegas. Gorgeous work from Vegas there. Once again, the fadeaway. Nero is still trying to get towards that bomb site. Fame coming up from deep smoke. It's not a joke. They're sending it. Whoa, the lineup only gets one. The bomb's still moving though. Nero's got it. Number four, number four got really bad timing. Evans just got some gonna really weird timing. For too much longer. It's gonna work. It should work out in their favor. It should work out. Here favorite. comes the assassin in the form of Purge. He's about to hit the is ladder. He's gonna read this, this though. He might die. For DC. Ah, uh, he's just underneath, actually. No. Well, he's still been uh, very sneaky. You see, Diamond Con knows that some funny business might be up, but the funny business was the bomb playing spot purge, able to at least hunt him down, though, so his position pays off long-term. Adam Assault for the 1v2. He wants right to catch me. a player oh. when he's planting the bomb. He might be able to catch him here. Caught. Bomb didn't get planted. 20 seconds to go. Purge playing the man, not the bomb. And here comes the check. That's the gunfight. Purge gets it. Assault could only find one from there. Dude, he Purge rapped behind me? This guy's a moron. <laughs> Keep the Vegas run alive. Yeah, Purge, just a, uh, a good poker player. You play the, the man, not the hand. Knows Adam Salt going to be playing distant. Wants to catch him when he's going for the bomb. It's a really big map. I feel like I no should have probably won this map. They're, they're pretty good down. at Karachi. Incredibly consistent, this rookie. I'm telling you, making the heads up plays. Respawn, S&D, all the same to him. 
Let's go, guys. Good guys, Zero. They're just taking LAG to task. It has not been remotely close. We saw some good close moments in the opening six star, but here we're looking at six one unless LAG yeah, well, can turn things start. around. Purge, man of the moment, gets himself to AC, calls the cucumber. Might be able to catch a few players out. Oh, this is a lovely angle to be. One. Got the teammates' coverage there as well. This could be a first blood, right where he left the last round off. He's making. He's, he I wants mean, Adam to shoot at his, his teammate. I think Atash sort of gave up on the gunfight there, but Adam Assault at some point is just going to meet his fate. I have to imagine. Oh, no. Good oh, job nice. getting away, bro. But look at number, look, look at number six. Like oh, good job, Nero. This as well. Oh boy, starting to fall to pieces. Another one v one win as Purge on a five spree now. Estriel is going to send it, and this could be the streaks. Oh, wow. That's it. That's that the round, and that's Vegas. Yeah, it, that's got to be the game too, right? Purge has the cruise missile now. Vegas have been looking unstoppable, untouchable. And again, their trade's been fantastic. This has just been like electric teamwork the entire time. Second before shot Even for the moment for Purge up top, where I'm Wait, thinking he's actually say that or kill you lying, He house? actually plays it patient enough and to make sure that it's more play. of a guarantee. And obviously in that round, he turns that into a, a nice little three kill round as well. So Vegas continue to do whatever they want. They get all the map control in the world. And the only rounds where LAG have fought back at all when the trades have come through, they have struggled even and lower man sort of engagement fights. And once again, Vegas, three players over towards B. Purge on an island. He's got a cruise. Why not? Take your time, call it in, get the bomb down, win the round. There it comes. Perfect relay of information. Oh, Geo is going to start to eat alive. LAG running out of options. Assault managed to dodge that one well. You've had to sacrifice a tremendous amount of map control. Geo finds kill number two. And that could be it. Bomb down. Yeah, rookie dominance in this one. It and Geo picking up the extra couple kills off the intel. I'm gonna give out back shots. Unstoppable in these moments. Even the stun here to make Estriel's life hell. He's in a 1v3 in an unclutchable round. You called it from a 6 star to a 6 1. Vegas Legion looking perfect. Back shots. Thank you, thank we might not get a beast, though. We get high rise control at his uh, Vegas' preferred control map to play. Dominant work there in the search and destroy. They close out the six star. They take a 2 0 lead in the series. That's back shots enabled, man. Back shots enabled. Super ones, too. Online struggles continue. Air control okay. next, though. You never know, mate. You never know. Uh, I, well, you never know, but Vegas, like, did they improve? It seems like even more so. Like, keep in mind for stage two, a couple roster changes and purge switched roles, and they were like pretty Evan optimistic. Evan has the last seven kills, three most damage in the lobby. Lane, Damn. But they were showing improvements throughout the stage. I mean, they looked incredible. I'd say Adam right now having an insanely bad yeah, series. Remember what I said earlier, man. Adam is on the chopping block. It was just again too easy. Nine I was. I think I'm gonna play a little bit of rank and then Walking Dead at 5:30. A little bit of ranked, maybe some eights if we can get some going for like an hour or two. And then I'm going to play a walk in the for sure house. Because I want to, I can't wait to play. Dude, I'm not going to lie to you. That cliffhanger history was, they got to chill. I actually don't like playing the game house because the cliffhangers are a little too high for me right now. I'm not going to lie to you. I kind of, like, I feel like almost kind of forced to play another one. But I, I've been, you know, I need to take care of myself. I need to make sure that I'm good. Because tomorrow I need to go, tomorrow I need to go live early as fuck. Because I got UFC. I might not be able to watch all the matches. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm gonna have a decision to make. You know, I'm gonna have a, deci gonna have a decision to make. Yeah, definitely for sure. I rarely ever do that. I've only done that for my sister's birthday, like I think ever, unless my internet power was out. But like besides that, like I watch every single match with you guys. I was like, I'm gonna get my water bottle. I'm gonna leave the king up. I'm literally pissing and getting my water bottle. I don't think oh, I'm always leaving there and breaks. Like yes, I am. But like not really. Like I apologize. Yeah, like, like, I'm flying. It was like. Like, Honestly, what'd you I, grab I, from the East Coast in the motherland? Say it again? Like, what'd you grab that you normally got from the East Coast, but you got It's very different over there. So like, different. The pizza was similar the first day. Like, the first day's pizza was kind of similar yeah, was. to, like, a normal pizza over here. Slump. Greasy. Slump. Slump. Wait, slump the one in the shop, in the pizza shop. Yeah, yeah. slump. Yeah. Okay, the, yeah. The first day. I mean, yeah, the, I mean, the espresso co culture over there was crazy. I mean, it'd Was be that like the first so place we went to? Yeah, that nah. was the cafe with that. Oh, yeah, oh, like yeah. Costa Rica is what it was called. Yeah, Costa, Rica Costa Rica cafe. Yeah. yeah, I love that place. Too. And we didn't know this, but they give you seltzer water so that you can cleanse your palate. What we didn't know if it was you drank it first and then you drank the espresso, or you drank it after the espresso. Still to this day. No, before they said before. I was doing both before to cleanse your palate. No, but then the guy at our hotel said after. Yeah, but he's from Spain and just moved there. 
Oh, but he was fair. the one serving the espressos. Ladies and gentlemen, you are you're already ahead of it. We're giving away a Wingstop hundred dollar gift card. Look at them. Yes, sir. They're already ahead of it. Go word optic hundred dollar gift card. Ladies and gentlemen, corduroy. Post your pet for a chance to win a corduroy pet bed. You know corduroy, the world's only bean bag with a bed inside. Now get ready for an exclusive offer just for a pet. Post a picture of your furry friend and tag both Optic and Corduroy on X. You might get chosen tomorrow to win a free pet bed. Post now and stay tuned for tomorrow's Who's watch party. Who's the judge party, on this? Where we will pick a winner. Must tag at Optic and at Corduroy to be randomized. eligible. We will. Are we picking the winner tomorrow? Yeah, randomized. Oh. oh so wait, top five. Wait, okay, wait, wait, so we're going to pick wait, the winner what's, tomorrow. What's top sure. Five? The top five best pictures of their dog? And who decides that? It should be Us. random. No, we do. We who pick. has the cutest baby? We the pick. cutest fur baby? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I actually love this. We if get to see other people's doodle, you pets. Got me. I love that shit. Jude, do not post. Uh, I know you're watching. Don't post any. I love it. Do that right there. Add optic at corduroy for a chance. Add a pet bed. That dog looks comfy, It's man. just your pet, right? I, 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 you don't need to have the corduroy bed. You will win that if they if these guys pick it. Correct. Pick your 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 furry baby, <laughs> your fur baby, <laughs> your mini minu. Uh, Jason said, "You guys are looking like the optic of old with the content coming out recently and the boys killing it on the league." Green wall for life. Much love, Hex. Thanks for creating such an amazing org. I wouldn't uh, have been able to do it without the help of my friends who literally did they thing. So it wasn't a w it was team effort, gosh darn it. Team effort. Scuff with a 10. That's very nice of you. I haven't heard you say that. I've always said that. Always. Every single chance. That's very every nice. single chance. Yeah, yeah I'm going to sit there and take credit for myself. Yeah, I You're like this. I <laughs> You're like the mastermind. <laughs> I won 35 <laughs> championships in Call of Duty. <laughs> I wish. I wish I had We were in Italy skills. because. If, uh, if you were born 10 years earlier? Later? Oh, yeah, yeah later. 10 years later. You guys would have been like, oh, yo, Hex, his, this, his knife's crazy. <laughs> Hell yeah. We were in Italy for uh, a collab with Juventus, and going to my first ever football game was the time of my life. You would say, say Juventus. I said Juventus. Yeah, he says Juventus. Juventus. Well, you guys, the, it's how you end it that, that, I, Juventus. that I have a problem with. See, right now, giveaway. Right now, $100 Juve, gift card to Juve, 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 Juve. Uh, Scuffin, when do shout out to you guys? When does the Miami merch ship out? That is a mark question. We're just going through the final uh, Damn. quality checks. They're going crazy right now with all the all the. Shouts all out the to everyone that picked up some R and L. I'm actually wearing the Boston drop right here. Yeah, that's fire. Well, I'm shing. So it should be less than like the winner like is a Jay. Week Congratulations, half, Jay. Jay, congrats, buddy. Thanks for joining us. Get the most congrats, damage congrats, by one point one k. That's crazy. I chat. I'm fucking back. No more pissing. I'm good. I just pissed. Coffee, Dunsey, look, boom. Now I have to wash my cup, not my cup, my plate from the yogurt. You know what I'm saying? Good manners. No more Good manners, all 2024. I chat, back shots enable at the current moment. We might be having a DoorDash day of hell. Vegas Legion at series points. One map away from closing us out on the day on a Friday. First day back of matches, man. Rise control the last chance here for LAG in the series to stay alive. And the yeah, man. Ooh. Evan looks I'm pretty good sure to him, and he, he had an average map uh, one. Well, he had an amazing map two, like a fucking table map two. Definitely lean towards uh, LAG, more of their bread and butter. Maybe a spicy thing, though, that you see on the side of Vegas is that they only had two wins on this map in two and two in the round fives as well. So a team that often goes the distance and maybe each of these teams just looking for that one offensive win to it's a secret although i agree with you competitive wise it has been as it has not been as in the regards of we're watching first blood and fame mc so many new uh maps and game modes and watch both already we're only missing one so win back at major two in that regards it's been a great day fame Gets thinged by Purge flying through there with a Renetti. Another one from That's attached a bad there. break off here. Also, can I die? Can I die, Adam? Lick it, literally lick it. Find the kills all over the place. I, think Bro, I always tell you guys, once right you get out, please do everything you can yeah, to stay out. Do not get spawn trapped. Uh, both power positions on both teams. The map secured by some AR players. Vegas attached down low. And, well, you got Nero living inside of your spawn. So everything that could go wrong might go wrong. But Nero, Ooh, last one standing, gets that's cleaned bad. up. So LAG have battled. They have dealt with the spawn trap. And they've gotten out with a little bit of 
pressure on A. One pump, one pump, two. Yep. Low, though. Nice little snap for working together with his teammate. And, I mean, oh! Thinks about turning around in shots like that. Oh my god, man. Cut lame ass game. Killed the highlight. Wow, what a lit start. I killed the highlight. Kills the highlight, chat. Vegas still holding the line. Massive pressure up the B Street. But Gio, once again, he's absolutely slamming to start the series off. Six and three. Number three has to win out. You know what I'm saying? It's it's Dude, but he has to find Gio one. Just find one. Up, by the way, his nope. damage numbers. But he got his one, though. He got his one. That's all the info in the world. Round. Uh, he has been shooting laser point. Everybody inside LAG desperation. I mean, what? 12 seconds oh, left on the rookie. clock, and you got to go stand on one of the zones just to stop it. Estriel gives it the old college try. He gets cut down immediately. Assault's gonna have to fly out and do the same, but there is just nowhere to go. Damn, Zero that takes it really bad. Absolutely suffocating Zero takes round there. Crazy. Vegas Legion. That is about as clean as you could ask for. They might There's have failed water, in the spawn trap in that one moment, but outside of that, that was dominant. Absolutely brilliant opener. They're continuing the run they had from Karachi. They've not slowed down a minute. Vegas Legions. Very, very good on defense. We'll see if they can keep it going on the offensive round now. LAG, your chance to bounce back. Spicy one. And Geo, look how happy he is. He's well proud of himself. I mean, yeah, one of those guys just doesn't blink. You know he gets turned for match day. Absolutely rocking and rolling. Here we go, though. Attacking around Vegas. Legion. See if Attach can close out that three spree. Get himself towards six. As it will be the favorite word we say on broadcast. So pretty much from here on out, six star, six rounds, six spree. Uh, well, if Toronto ever plays, we got the six on the six. Oh Gotta my God. keep those in mind as well. But long way to go before we get there. Nero right now dancing as well. is taking about six bullets while standing on side the hill. But now six seconds of contest time. But the salt makes the move. Slides yeah, into death. And the slow progress over towards B continues. If they, if they could and just again, the trades right now are fantastic. Down, you point out attacks. Think about too? going on the six yep. spree. Yep. One kill away. He's going to get it. So we get a segment as well. Here comes Diamond Con. Just gonna hop up. Right Burn should have this. Attached for the trade if not, and it all works out. Quick check. That's it. Streaks in the bag. You're looking at the B zone as well. It's a glorious offensive from Vegas Legion. Yeah, six spree there, and well, with the three segments captured, they're halfway to getting the six they need in this round. And attached right now, maybe shooting like the devil. They got a nice little hold on the map. Plenty of players pushed up. They're just waiting for the kills to flow their direction. Geo, the omnipresent force inside of the hill. And attached continues. He's 10 and 2 in these he two loves rounds. This map. He has been everywhere. I love this shit. Too. Don't get it twisted. Maybe eyes on a few more. Both players get spotted too. Tough to deal without that. Oh, went through the fence. Nero, though, finding kills. Can I die when I get killed? So now Vegas Legion. Nero cutting down players. Oh, shit. We lagged. This boy's a tiny bit of space to work with. The still not. Right a spree from him. Two minutes on two on the game clock, and the second segment's gone. You're not going to need the whole lot. This should be round. Vegas. Oh, oh my God! A tactical nuke out of Adam Assault, but Nero is still on the point. Oh, Assault, he's no. just too icy. Look at him yeah, go. Bro. That's Soul the just double funniest three spree. Right? I mean, my bad. I was talking about I've seen him quite shit. some time. So Vegas doing literally everything right, except not exploding. That's tough. Idiots, why didn't they not explode? The hard work drained, attached now calling the crews. They're not letting this round get away from him. We're committing. Top of high rise has become an absolute slaughter. Finds nothing with it. Pressure still on. LAG are not out of this yet. Well, the bigger problem I think LAG are going to have is just the life count at this point, right? They were getting forwarded enough early on that they're down to 11. Every single kill is going to set them back that much further. And now Purge, well, away. set up for the spawn traps. Also has what the dolphin the dive on, so maybe another hybrid player in the mix. But uh -oh. right now it's just attaching the feed. Assault last man close, standing like... aggressive on the map. Purge going hunting. Purge collecting oh. that extra scalp. And while he gets traded from LAG, so one shot, bro. it's five lives remaining. Make it just four. Gonna this himself, would be himself, boom. Uh, virtually oh. impossible for LA to win. Yeah, this would be very impressive indeed. We're not going to drain that segment oh. either. Uh oh, Geo punches his way through that oh, it's left over. flank. What the fuck? That's not my bad. I don't so know trying to keep it safe, trying to stabilize. Still on towards the zone we go. Nine to two you now. Into a dead dwindling. Name. They're over by the A zone. <laughs> a slow and steady approach here from Attach should get it. Fame. Not gonna find oh, fight. shit! Attaches them both. My good God. Back shots of hell chat. Absolutely a deserved round. Despite the madness, the absolute shenanigans. I'm sure we've got a replay. Uh, 
I mean, look, there's a lot of fun everywhere. As you pointed out, yeah, the whole propane nuclear explosion on top of high rise. Uh, not ideal, but Attach just had an absolute monster round as well. Literally from the opening break, he was just the coverage for his teammates that were slowly capturing the B zone. He picks up extra maybe three or four kills along the way, then jumps in the zone and does it himself and still stays alive for another minute where like the damage and output that he was getting, he's just coming to his teammates, almost like a funnel system, telling them exactly where to look. So Attach making the game incredibly easy right now for his teammates is... I mean, we might be on board with just another freaky fast Friday. It might be a, a six hour on the day. Super freaky fast Friday. Oh, not faded. It might happen. What the fuck? Five to what was that play for? Is Fame so okay? If they Start manfling in front of another player? Around, again defense. But we'll see what happens because, uh, again, anything and can and will happen here in the CDL. It's no way did on purpose. I, I have to be on accident. I'm going to chalk it up to an accident. Literally nice. poetry in motion. Still alive for the moment. And you capture on both zones as well. Man, kind of actually, what the gunfight over towards A? I was going to say, as long as he's staying alive, it's going to make that B zone capture effectively a guarantee. That's kind of the way his teams want him to play. Like, Nero plays the game at such a second, insane speed. The trades are there, but not before the zone actually gets captured. So, nice plays from LAG. They get one zone on board, but still a long way to go. Long way to Two minutes, though. Long way to go, but plenty of time to get it done. Attach keeping the kills going. 18 and 6 so far for Dylan Price. Urge down low, makes it all his. Over to Nero, right side windows, not Thinking a good I die, place to be right to get now. A kill. Just find one opening, to open the lane for his team. Uh, opening right there. I mean, LAG, they just can't find a groove. They're stuck in a situation 19, where they're just like getting six. caught sprinting, back in the spawn trap, nobody has pressure anywhere. Overheated, overheated, you've it's okay. You've opened up like the Front. green tarp side of the map, but that's, you've made it five feet out of your spawn. Congratulations, you still got a long way to go. Estriel, the furthest forward nero though on a nice little head glitch the teamwork is there but uh, Estri, you gotta is you gotta also really picks up the right there, big not bait for adam yeah, or so, i know he's your teammate but like just, just keep it above spawn not able to really make anything happen on the map they had two minutes to play with now it's a poultry one estriel finds a way out nero tries to put him back in a cage but they're fighting attach is so sneaky so dangerous 22 and 7. 22 and 8. Lives are weird, he's though. Like, look at the lives. I mean, yeah, he's been able to do virtually whatever he's wanted the entire time. This is close on life count, though. Inside of the spawn traps coming through, LAG have at least kept it even because they had enough success early on. Now we're on the zone. Assault desperate for some help, and he's just simply not going to get it in time. So they will be the last man standing, waiting for the reinforcements, and he can't buy nearly enough time to make something happen. 37 seconds left on the clock. I LAG game is on cross. the yeah, line. We're going to have to make this play the one to really seal the deal. It has to be a, will it be a Freaky piece. Friday or will it be the be fantastic turnaround here? Diamond Con has taken the longest route he could possibly take. Oh, oh my God, God brother. Magnificent work. LAG's got three to, to go. fuck. Two oh, brother. Back now shots enabled. G Con. fucking G. It is over. It is done. He will fight his way out of spawn into nothing. But the end of the series screen 3 0 Vegas Legion. An absolute bloodbath. And that is absolutely. That is what the, the, the fifth best team in the game should be doing every match. That, like, we've seen them play on the that is what the like fifth best team in the game should be doing every single time fantastic. against teams that are not on the they top four, bro. Good. Their teamwork looked like he was flowing. Assuming LA Thieves just doesn't Karachi decide to start fighting SMD, back, of course. A near flawless performance. And maybe I know that sort of, you know, Six Star was getting out of control for a minute, but they almost had like a 250 to 120 beat down as well if Gorillas didn't start popping off on a few key hills. So I think Vegas in the meantime might have gotten even stronger. And yeah, my word, Dylan Attach, 25 and 9. That's a fantastic KD, 4,800 damage. He was simply able to do whatever he tough, wanted. Man. So that's that a door dash challenge back to back, man. I mean, that is flawless stuff out of attach. MVP of that series. Or Both of the ours had at sure, least damage in the lobby. Just, that dude, is I mean, the two really, rookies performing really, as really well. Tough. Heads up plays out of control. Nero when he needs to just 180 somebody. He's successful at that as well. Uh, this is the team that I think a lot of people had as maybe the clear cut fit best in the league. And they certainly looked like it. No Vista, Char no, like no Vista, right unlucky. There. Absolutely brilliant second half of the series there out of Vegas. 6-1-3-0. As a six-star hard point, hey, man, it was fun to watch. We didn't get a second taste of Vista here on this Freaky Friday, but absolute slammage in both of our series. That's it. You guys can all go back to whatever you're doing on this Freaky Friday, whether you're at work, you're sitting at home. I mean, I'm personally, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go play some ranked. What about you, Charles?
I absolutely playing ranked. I need more. Uh, now that I've seen six star on like the mini map, I got to get some reps in. Well, we're going to go play ranked for now. We're also going to go back to the desk. Assault, can I keep stealing up? Good luck, champs. Best luck getting into plat tonight there. Uh, <laughs> but we're going to have an excellent day of matches tomorrow. Trust Crazy me. Crazy though, a little too fast, too furious. Let's revisit what just went down here as Vegas Legion takes care of business. A 3-0 to claim the, the official number five chest. spot on our leaderboard behind our big four. Uh, I just want to say, Chris picked LAG. I did. You did pick LAG. Yeah, uh, I thought like Ali picking a purple team was very confident and really cool. And then I tried to do it, but I forgot that LAG sucks on. Oh, D. What? Oh, fucking here, D. Nameless? Because you told me. Oh, four to makes his debut tomorrow. This is online. They're not. Jesus. Win. Yeah, I mean, honestly, they've just been terrible online. I, I really don't know what it is about them. You know, you talk about a team, they're eight and three in Church and Destroy. I saw Allie in the green room. She was going over numbers. She looks up and she goes, LAG are statistically the best Church and Destroy team since the start of stage two. And I'm like, yeah, they actually are. <laughs> well, there's a couple reasons why. They were number two in first blood conversion, number one in plant win percentage some key fundamentals in this series completely out of the window right. clearly vegas had done their research they were able to shut down guys like diamond con in the control you know and those that high rise is a map that's given both these teams trouble so that bodes well for vegas Ali, how does attach get the same amount of deaths as diamond con does kills uh because attach is a very good at the video game good performance yeah. from veteran players like attached today could earn your scuff play of the game while we get that ready i gotta talk to you about geo here ali it's not attached Last today four it's the other ar who is putting in work for your three. birthday lucas i mean, I mean luke i'm not gonna lie to you on my birthday i go bro or i don't go bro actually i don't know lucas i'm the worst person to ask about birthdays lucas because i never got to celebrate mine Growing up, I don't have a single memory of me having like an insane birthday. Yeah, this is a team that respawn wise was very we fundamental. That, like, you know what I'm saying? I was in blessed enough to have like getting better, and as the team gets better, so I don't really know. Geo Maybe like to find more success. I'd go to GSK Factor. That That's what I would get. Great in the control I like GSK Factor well. a lot. And, uh, it's think not expensive either. So it's cheap. It's like it's like mid tier. Like he's gonna beat the bottom teams. They're gonna draw a line in the sand to the bottom half of the league, and that's what they desperately need to gain points. I also want to say, if you miss that first hard. Lucas' birthday, Dimitri. He's asking what you get for Go dinner. Go back, watch this game, and just keep your eye on Purge on the minimap. Yeah, the man played point. it nearly perfect. You'll get so many free kills if you play the cutoffs like that man did tonight. Please don't the the Right now, though, it's our monster winner spotlight. We got the old man. He still looks young and handsome. Attached joins us live. The old Attached, man is crazy. Congratulations on another 3-0. Oh, you are officially the fifth best team in the league right now. What do you think separates you from the rest of the pack? Uh, honestly, just the work we've been putting in. Actually, wait, don't forget the comment. I don't, I'm not old, okay? I'm not old. I still got it. You How know? old are you, by the way? But, um, <laughs> uh, I think 27. 27. What do you mean you think? <laughs> what do you mean you think? No one near 30 like me. Was. I got you. Sorry, keep going. Three, you forget what age you are. But nah, honestly, the team's just been going really hard in scrims ever since we got back from the event. We've had a really good talk. Oh, Lucas, like, do not get talked about. That is disgusting, so, so much bro. improvement in stage two. And we're like, guys, we're like right there. If we keep going hard and can do this consistently every single day, who knows where it's going to take us. But it kind of showed right there in that match. Like we had our moments where we were sloppy. But when we were in control, we kind of were able to like stay in control. Yeah. And uh, it, felt, it felt great. The teamwork's flowing. I didn't do good first map, but my boys got me through it. So it's, a, it's beautiful to see the teamwork work, work, uh, like, work together. Yeah, for sure. And, you know, we just added two new maps, which we didn't get to see the second one in your mm -hmm. series, but we saw Six Star. Could you tell the fans at home what it's like as a professional team to learn these maps, especially so quickly, having to play them not even two weeks later? Um, yeah, it could kind of suck when your good maps get taken out because you're like, oh, uh oh, are we going to be good at the new maps or are we going to start losing them? But uh, we're feeling really good on all the new maps. And I think it's just fun to play. Like, it's a good switch up because Playing the same maps the whole year gets old and boring, so it's fun for the players, fun for the fans, fun for everyone that watches. So I'm excited to have them. What's the process like? Do you guys just jump right into scrims on those maps, or do you go in beforehand in private lobbies, try to figure out all the cheese? What's that like? Um, well, first, a couple days we were scrimming like 13, 14 maps, because this map was going to be in, this map was going to be in, this map was going to yeah. be out. So there was so much confusion amongst everyone. Scrims were last until like 10 p.m. it felt like, but um, when you finally find out the matches, that's when you go into overdrive, watch the VOD, figure out good nade spots, good break offs, how to hold certain hills, how to break certain hills, and then you really get nerdy once like you find out if the map's going to be in or not.
Uh, Dylan, it seems like you guys are right there on the cusp, right? Like sitting in fifth, outside looking in. A lot of people would say that it's a four-team league. But you guys are right there. What's it really going to take for you guys to crack in and become a top four team? Oh, good question. I think it's just our search and destroy becoming that next level because that's what hindered us at the last tournament and last stage. Uh, I mean, we were great in control or great in hard point, decent in control, and didn't win a search at the tournament. We win the search, who knows how much further we could have went. So search and destroy is definitely like our biggest focus right now. Um, that's just all comes down to preparation and then knowing what to do in the mid round. And if we can get that down, I could definitely see us cracking in the top four and uh, making some deep runs at these tournaments. So. Attach, I have a feeling we'll be talking with you in another monster winner spotlight. It could happen as early as Sunday as you take on LA Thieves. Before you go, shout out from the chat. This is from Devious. He says, Attach the type of guy who believes WWE is real. With wrestling being <laughs> real, who is your favorite wrestler, Attach? Ooh, like all time? Yeah. Oh man, I mean, you gotta go with The Undertaker. Like The Undertaker, when the when the bell goes or his like theme song goes the stadium goes dark oh man i would pay so much money to see that like in his prime in person but like that would that would be crazy that, that is the correct crazy. answer attached thank you for joining us here in the monster winner spotlight that was a good question Wait, can i give a shout out real yeah quick? yeah can i give a shout out all right uh you know shout out a statement of better days ahead collab today drop and make sure you go check it out on better days ahead.com or something let's go new drop v2 we're fucking back oh we're back yeah <laughs> That's attached. He's my favorite oh, sensor player. Man, dude. Love you all. Check out so his new gear. So the clean. second drop is coming. These COD players making millions in game, out of game. You love to see it, Allie. I do love to see it. I especially love those drops from Statement Up. They're great. Undertaker? Yeah. Bro, it is not Undertaker. It's, it is Brock Lesnar, bro. It is Brock Lesnar. You hear the theme song? That is who's the. I chat. I'm going over to Twitch, man. Uh, they went with the came through. Followed, sub, supported, came through on a different website. It means a lot to me. Thank you so much. It's a J Demetra, uh, my brother Lucas, Jammer, Travis, uh, Jack. It's a J was here the entire time. I appreciate you. House, uh, my brother Wombo, Lemon Squeezy, Bob, Tim, Jarrell. I'll see you guys on uh, Twitch immediately. Thank you all so much, man. Peace.